um, Mozzie from Rainbow. Um, I don't. Your, I haven't watched uh, that. <laughs> Uh, oh, Rainbow, Rainbow Six Siege. Siege. Yeah. Oh, yeah, no, nah, I haven't. He's Mozzie. Even though Mozzie's young and like a uh, 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 extreme sports. I'm not like... that old. What? <laughs> and I, I personally oh. have Cliff jumped in my sleep. How many people can say that I've done that? More Mozzie. I, I declare like myself to be um... Tachanka. Shut the fuck You're not Tachanka. You're like Capcan. You're the alligator. You're the literally oh, just alligator. Wait, Wait, you're a planet? Last, last... Mick, are you, are you no. a planet? No, um, in, t in, in Rainbow Six Siege, there's a Russian guy named Tachanka, and basically, he just carries around big guns. Like, he carries around a turret everywhere. I was thinking that you were talking about being a planet from yeah, Mass he's Effect. he's the lord. You're fucking, you're the... You're the lot captain. of spoilers You're the, you're the lurker clip. stalker that just um, sits inside of... Um, yeah. cabinets with bombs on, everywhere. Ready to be the last one alive. I will find this meme. Because well, I know I have it to chunk a meme. I uh, will download the um, new Voltron and check it out when I get a chance. But at the moment, I'm currently been listening to um, Yahtzee Croshaw's new book, um, "Will Destroy the Galaxy for Cash," and I'm up at about well, episode um, chapter seventeen. Hmm. All right, Ruby. And Once then I rewatch Guy for the I'm Bible. I'm going to show you drama. this meme. And it's going to be great. Okay. Um, let's see if I can find, um... Oof, ouch, fuck. Wait, what? Guys, oh, yeah. Have you ever, have you ever had, have you ever had your girlfriend leave a note on it working, but then when you open it, it still works? Leave a what? Wait, 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 what? Have you ever had your girlfriend leave a note on the fridge that says, this isn't working, but then you open the fridge and it works? <laughs> Dude, yeah, no, that's just, that's just, it's annoying. Cause it's like, bitch, what do you mean? It's working. No wonder we're gonna probably get divorced. You divorce your girlfriend? It's, yeah, it's yeah. like Obama, you know? Last year he was, last year he was 56, this year he's 57, which is it? Obama, pick one. Oh my god, always lying. Uh, I've rewatched, um, Guy of the Bio Boosted Armor. <laughs> And basically, this is pretty. What I just posted, not in memes, is pretty much one of the final scenes of the season, and it's just so epic. But it leave they leave it open, and the show never continued. Mm. Oh, I love oh, it. Well, anyway, Ruby, I finally showed up. Oh God, what is this? Okay, well that's an awesome gift. What is this? Emer Um, that is... What, you mean the one I posted or the one fucking, for Mika? Oh, this is... That's Russian Badger. Oh god, let's see what he does. Round. Cross, oh we indeed love scene. Oh my god. Wait, I'll, that wasn't that during the, um, T-Pain versus Lil Yachty game? I have no idea. It All was, I know is that he was, did it. and that is the best, one of the best. So, it's literally T-Pain versus Lil Yachty. T-Pain literally had, like, three gamer girls and Russian. That was what his team was, and while well, Lil Yachty like had a bunch of like um, neck beard pros, and guess who won? Motherfucking T Pain. Why? Because Badger literally carried, and with Tachanka, he literally got a spawn peak with his pistol against pros, and that's hilarious. Nice. He's also anyway. fucking like he's like seven feet tall, so he towered above everybody there, including T Pain. All right, so we're on the ship. Yes, you are currently on the yeah. ship. Um, let's see. You've what a recap on what we did last time. Um, fourteen days to uh, last time. Last time we went to the last ship, and you had you had your free day basically. Um, like you've got a day where you're getting your mechs are getting repaired. And yep. so, if I remember correctly, um, Kamiko, you gained um, horse phobia, extreme fear of horses. Yes. Um. Uh, curse your auto clicker, Sid. I'm trying to yeah, scroll so up to see now. the freaking um, translation of it, <laughs> and it's just like. So now we've got a um. What the fuck is this, Sidron? What the hell? <laughs> Wait, what are you doing? Where? What? No, remember last time the auto clicker incident? <laughs> See if you scroll okay, up, well, it's just like um, uh, it's like 
Hug oh, yeah. her, hug her. Hug lesbian <laughs> gifts. Uh -huh. Anyway, so I have a big tooth. Um, I actually I fully healed my mech last time. Uh, so I I did I did remove the uh, repair only power cell. I've got four left. Yep. And um, let's see. If you want to divvy them how up, much money do um, I have? how much did I charge you for that? What was it? Um, Two fifty each. Two fifty each. That's right. Yeah. So if anybody wants to buy a repair cell, which is just a very small battery that you plug into your fabricator, um, that will repair your mech. However, it can't be used for anything else but repairing. So you can't get XP for it, you can't insert it into a weapon, you can't do anything like that. It's strictly for repairing a mech. Um, so if you... Yeah, I, I, um, 250 I think, credits each. I, I think you let me... You said when I got them that you would let me use them to uh, upgrade... Um, at Stuff. most, I'll let you, you basically use them for maybe if you're going to, say, do it for a drone, because that is yeah. a, that is technically a mech, so you'd be yeah, able to use it for you, repairing a drone, right. but you won't be able to use it to upgrade a drone. Yeah, that's sorry. That would, that's what you uh, that's what you did say. Yes, I am. I am misremembering, but I got it fairly close. Yep. No, you're close. Um, so, it's it's splitting hairs, really. Because you really so, don't so upgrade um, a drone, you more and less um, because that comes down to the rolls. Speaking so of drones, better. sorry. Scott, if if I if I were on. to take this, I said, could you turn uh, yourself up just a little bit because you're coming through very quiet uh -huh. for me. Wow. Okay. SCP okay. memes. SCP memes. SCP memes. SCP memes. So, Lavitz, I have a question. Um, speaking of this drone that I've got, quote, utterly destroyed drone rip. How many repair cells is it going to take to repair it? Um, you're going to have to get some drone parts, um, to because most of the parts have been destroyed. So basically, all you've got eight. is like chunk of steel. Um, I'm going to say, actually, roll me a D8. And, I have eight drone parts. Well, roll me a D8, Jesus. and we'll see how many parts it's going to. Right. It's going to take all of them to repair the drone part. Repair the drone. All right. Well, that's good. So and one I'm repair out. cell. All right, and that's three left. So, no, that's one. eight. Oops. Oh, yeah. oh yeah. sorry, never mind. Oh, sorry. Oh. Oh. Uh, yeah, I've got. Okay, hold on. Okay, okay. So what happened was, I put in one utterly destroyed drone rip, but I forgot to remove one repair drone last time. So, I mean, it, it's fine. I've just been playing as if I didn't have it. So, I'll, I'll just remove the destroyed bit. And yep, keep so I just put down one good. repaired drone. Yep, I got that. Yep. Now, if you want to put is... um, certain upgrades on that, what's your drone level? Um, mine is, I believe, two, but I'll check. No, it's just one. Okay. I have two in implants. That's right, yep. Two in that, that allowed you to actually have it further away from you, so I could actually repair others. Yes. That's right. So I'm trying to remember because, um, you know, each version is a little bit different. Now, Ruby, yeah, I'm getting a bit of an echo back through you. Why do you hear me? I don't know. It's, it's my nature. <laughs> a, scorpion mu a scorpion must sting, an Australian must be critical. That's fair. Uh, Ruby, it's because you're a woman. Uh, that's true. Yep, my soggy... Sub sub subhumans. It's my soggy knees. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, see, my dog's mad now. How do you feel? Also, I'm spamming your... I feel vindicated. ...meme chat with... With um, Doge memes, how do you feel, retard? I don't get the Doge memes, so they're just kind of like gibberish to me. Most of them are too <laughs> You're wordy. Now, retard. Most of them are too wordy for me. A meme needs to be short, sweet, punchy. Nah. That's why I don't get Kamiko's memes a lot of the time because they're always like half a fucking novel. The weekly memes are pretty fire. No, they're pretty cringe as well. Nah, sometimes. Just like Kamiko. Did, did someone say cringe? <sighs> Dude, I, I love cringe. 
good. Look at all the cringe doge memes I just put. You're someone. I just don't get them. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Um... Where is Spartacus retard? I'm Spartacus. Spartacus. Um, I still have one full repair cell left. All right. So if you want to go and After buy some, fully repairing. Yep. No problem. If you want to buy them, um, yeah, two hundred and fifty credits each. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Anyway, now's now's as good a time as any to speak to the captain. All righty. The uh, captain is currently on the bridge. He is just basically you guys have just returned from the I oh, know you haven't. Um he's just doing a basic check of the systems. Alright. So I just say, hey, uh gonna do a, should I do another debriefing of what we've found in the ship? He's like, um, sure, why not? Just remember to upload right. it to AIDS as well. Uh, yes. I'm doing that right now. So, we current, uh, from what we found, the ship in question had a, was, uh, incapacitated, but it did have the crew attempting to repair it. Uh, one of the alien squad commanders from earlier, which, uh, which are some form of psionic alien, uh, was sacrificing itself to basically become the ship's new brain. We stopped that by killing it, and we've cleared out the ship. I think it's safe to assume that the same is that the same thing is happening on the other ships that have not yet been searched. He's like, very well, I shall report this to the to RCL and its command and inform the other salvage ships that they need to keep an eye out for that. Have we gotten any word from the other two ships? You're cutting out, Kamiko. Sorry. Just gonna... Hold on. There we go. I needed to cough. So... Uh, have we gotten any word from the other two salvage ships out there? Or... Um, no. Yes. The let me just bring up the map. Um. By the way, if you hear like lots of screeching and chunking noises and whatnot, um, that is because there's work being done just next to my house. You're murdering some children. <laughs> I'm not. Yeah, that's that, fine. I'm not that kind of man. <laughs> Bro, so you don't murder children in your basement. That's pretty cringe. Yeah. So I know. what have we heard from the ship? Uh, okay, I'm just bringing up the map, so then I can show you. Okay. Here we go. These two <laughs> have been salvaged. They got in there really quickly while you guys were. Um, asking about on the station, you know, doing stripping, having a good time. Um, they've managed to salvage these two ships. And they've managed to salvage this split in half ship, and same with this ship as well. Um, they have not experienced much of that, um, what you have, but they will be moving on to these sh ships soon. Um, or to the ship that you've cleared out up here. Uh, but so far they haven't experienced that the... because most of those ships, they got in there the next day. So the damage was... Like, they were still vented in... Sp you know, completely vented. And split open. So they haven't encouraged... Basically, haven't had to fight really anything. Um, other than a few repairers and stuff like that. Okay, well, that's good. So, I guess we should probably suggest to clear out that they salvage the one we just cleared out. 
and uh, then focus on us checking to yep. make sure the other team is non-functioning still. Well, if you want, while you're on the station, um, Picard can um, move back and forth and do a few trips wh where they can salvage the one that you've just done. This one up here on the top left. Next right. to the minefield, but he will be rolling checks on the minefield because no one really wanted to go near that because the anti-pursuit bombs are still active. Yeah, that's... Could we send somebody to, like, disarm and retrieve them? Um, once, once you set them, they set off in proximity, so you really can't get near them at all without them detonating. Mm. You can um, snipe them and blow them up, but you can't repurpose them and redo them, basically. That's too bad. So, um, other than that, uh, the reports... I would like to know if the captain is free for dinner. Hmm. Um, let's see how... Um, yeah, he can make time for uh, dinner or a brunch. Excellent. Up to you. Uh, probably dinner. Alrighty. Is this is ca is it casual or um dress up? Uh, or formal? I'll go right? casual. I'll go with casual. Alrighty. Yes. Okay. My only formal wear at the moment is a is a communist uniform, which I still need to check out. And um, yeah. Alrighty, this will be the action. So that will take up the probably the later portions of the day. So what we'll do is we'll do the earlier stuff during the day. So each of you have two actions for what you want to do during the day. Seriously, Ruby. You're spamming uh, the crap out of me, bloody I'm art meme section. I see, if you don't have a, a, a simple amount of doge in your Ooh. meme section, then you're fucking cringe. I don't know what They're a doge is. Us. I don't That's know. what doge is, retard. I don't understand you kids and your doges and your rock'em sock'em robots and your eight track tapes. I don't get it. Alright. Levitz, have you ever Sorry watched God. the Bop and Boopers commercial? They're like this. They're like these big inflatable fists, and um, in the in the commercial, one of the kids, like basically, it's a bunch of it's a toy for kids from like the nineties where you uh, beat up people with big inflatable fists. I think. And I in the trailer, it punches the other kid with a fist that doesn't have one of them on it. He just like straight up punches him. Uh huh. Yeah, I think I remember straight. that. Um, there used to be a yeah. TV um, a show in Australia, and it was called um, World's um, Funniest or World's Strangest Commercials, and they used to have a lot of those kind of commercials, and a lot of them were fucking hilarious. Half of them well, come Ruby, from I'm stealing this Titan for one. Dude, that one's good, right? Actually, the weirdest yeah. ones used to come from Sweden. Fuck. Oh, fuck Sweden's got the love. weirdest commercials around. Oh, bang along. As, as I was saying, I should look for my little time 10. I fear no man, but that thing, picture of a corner, it scares me. <laughs> Dude, this ugly son of a bitch is fucking super hot chicks and basically you're fucking stupid now. Just watch this free video. Yeah. Uh, Am I gonna have to put a time limit on here that you can only post every friggin' um. <laughs> Two minutes or something. Yeah, if you're fucking yeah. cringe. Yeah, I'm just have to blow the mode of the chat. Because you're <laughs> don't don't suppress my memes. Don't let will... be dreams. Don't suppress. All right, see, see the second the last meme I sent where it's like that little fucking there. retard doge that's like modeled to be like the Ugandan Knuckles. Oh yeah, I see that, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna round up round up about five hundred of those and have them fucking invade your house like the goddamn Great Crusades. 
Good luck. You know, what I'm going to do is... If you try and suppress my memes... <laughs> I'm pretty sure I got. I, I'm pretty sure they're from Australia. Ruby, no, they're from I Africa. Posted, Ruby. I posted an emote on your uh, thing from the Titanfall Discord. Hi. Right, let's see. It's fucking Marvin. Wait, where? Uh, on. on oh on shit! Name. Oh my god! Why? Why did you send? Why did you put? Oh, fuck! That felt weird. Oh, I hit my point. You're welcome I to the just market. hit my foot and it's swinging up. Anyway, what are you guys doing? I'm probably just gonna work on some of my mods. See if I can actually work on. Well, first, actually, I need parts. More parts. I, I said, could you before you do that? Could you do me a favor and turn your sent or uh, your output up a bit? Because I've got you maxed out, and you're coming through at about 15 percent. My my output is maxed out. Well, I've got everybody else at like fit, um a normal like at like dead center. Yours is maxed out, and I can barely hear you. Oh no! Oof! Uh, is yeah. this better? Oh fuck! Uh, what I might do is just turn everybody else down and oh crank my speakers fuck. a bit more. Huh. Oh, fuck yeah. That's a really fucking good use of that clip. That's a, that's a really fucking good use of that clip. That's a fucking... We need some top... We need some kek... Some fucking pay base and some keks in this chat. We need some of those emotes. We need a fucking poggers. Do we need a pot? Fucking, have, I'm pretty sure I have. Uh, I'm pretty sure I have a Pockers emote. Pico, allow me to edit. Yes, there he is. There's P Pockers. Ah, oh, what a lad. What an absolute. What an absolute lad. I fucking hate Poggers so much. Why, dude? Just, no, I mean, I mean, just like when people say it, ironically. I have no idea what the hell a Pogger is. That's a Twitch emote. It's a Twitch you emote. Know yeah. Uh, don't worry, Lavitz. Don't worry about it. Just, just know that there are some people who. There, there's one post from someone who went to a strip club, and when the stripper took off the, took off her clothes, and he saw some titty, he unironically said "poggers," and and then he posted it on Twitter, and he's like, "I'm a fucking disgrace to humanity." I mean, there's probably been cringier shit said in a in a strip club, so. Well, there's some cringe. Well, yeah, I've said cringy shit too. So I mean, fair enough. Have you been to a strip club? No. Yep. Yep. Well, yeah, well, Lavitz, you're fucking what? I've only been to one once, Shit, and I was drunk club? as fuck when I went there. I've got, I've got friends who keep saying, or, or well, no, there's people in my class who I don't really actually know, and they keep saying, Lavitz, what the fuck? Stop sending this shit. <laughs> but they keep on saying. Uh, basically, yeah, you know, oh man, I fucking love the strip club, blah blah blah. Yeah, not a great experience. <laughs> oh, where was Give me a second, I've got this. Yes, I was really about to monk a gun. Um, but wait, wait, why was your experience bad? I'm scared. What? You said you said your experience wasn't good. I'm saying I'm scared. Wasn't great. Well, well, do, well if why would you, you want to elaborate? To if not, it's cool. You can just get a titty. Uh, this is how oh, it was a while ago. Okay. That's like they're a hot shit. <laughs> Alrighty, so Sid, what were you doing? You were working on doing mod research and stuff, were you? Yeah, I was gonna search for some parts and see if I can mod the alien one. Um, yep, for the alien one, you'll need dedicated alien weapons to break down into parts to make mods. Because they don't really. 
they're com two, com different, two completely different oh types of um, matter, pretty much. Like, the alien <laughs> stuff is more organic than actually, um, than, you know. Well, I have the conduit um, material yep. I salvaged. I've got the one alien blade, as well as the mech class hybrid battery. Okay. Yep, I'll allow so you to um, muck around to see if you can make a mod for that. So give us a uh, D20 plus um, tech plus mod. Well, I don't have tech, but mod is at level 2.5. Yep, so that will be rounded down. That's a 13. Yes, okay, you make... You managed to muck around with it. Um, now, which one was this? Was this the one with um, one or two triggers? Uh, this was the two trigger one, if I'm not mistaken. It's the armor piercer one. Yep. Okay. Now I just got to remember the stats. Uh, um, yep. Um, you you managed to make. Um, actually, let me just. Okay. Yep. Um, you managed to make um, a small mod for it, but you don't really mod it in a sense that you kind of overclock it. And basically, you require one alien power cell to use each time, and then it will suffer a three-turn cooldown, but you'll be able to actually fire it, and it will actually pierce through um, for... Roll me a d20. Okay. Okay, for... I'm going to say... Um, 50 feet. It will do a concentrated beam that will go for 50 feet. And it will pierce through everything in its path. Damaging halving each time it goes through. So if you roll... 10 damage, the first one will take 10 damage, the one behind it will take 5 damage, the one be behind that will take 2 damage. And, and then, so on, it will uh, half each time. But it will right, be a we'll beam that up. will cut, um, pierce through. Uh, so we'll round up? Uh, round down. Okay. And when you do that, you'll basically have to eject it and reload it. Um, because it will drain the power cell completely. Okay. But it is a very good um, mod if you use it at the right time. Mm -hmm. Holy fuck. Amigo, I just found this. All right, well, that's kind of what I did. Okay. I'm going to say that took up two parts of the day. No pam. It's a very complex part, I would agree. Yep. Okay. Um, so you've got one more action before the end of the day, so what would you like to do for that part of the day? <laughs> Let demo that pan has arrived. Probably go actually down and gamble a bit with the fiery chick. No problem. I will move you all to uh, see your station and give it a zoom in um, are you gonna um, who do you want to gamble with um, the fiery chick which where did I put her oh right we had a D didn't we um, right. yeah now I can't remember where I put her oh yep there she yeah. is damn it oh yeah sorry I'm, oh. I'm juggling multiple maps and I can't grab shit We'll grab certain stuff on one map and autistic screeching. There's <laughs> actually, I remember, um, that just reminded me, I was playing Black Ops Zombies and there's literally a minigun they can get out of the box. And when you pack a punch it, this is of course a custom map, it's literally just called autistic screeching. <laughs> It has 999, wait, yeah, 
It has 99 bullets in the mag and 999 in reserve and it has like a super fast fire rate. Nice. Uh, Alright. Yes. So I give us... That reminds me of the uh, XO-16 accelerator. Bird. Mm -hmm. XO-16. Okay, so I give us a, um, um, a roll. Um, a D20 roll. Um, okay. And give us one more plus communications. Okay, very good. Okay, now let's just roll, see how they go. Okay, you clear the table. Um, you do really well. And let's just see how they respond. Okay, fiery chicks, not very happy. Oof. Um, mirrors, quite impressed by your skill. And you clear, and you end up with... Let me... Whoa. Okay, 1,900 credits. Nice. Although Fira is not very happy, she storms away from the table in just sheer frustration and the fact that she, she got beaten not only by a rival but also by you and the fact that she lost, you know, about 1,500 bucks. Mm -hmm. Cheap. And that ends your day. Okay. okay. Um, Ruby, um, before we start, I'm going to go for a quick piss and then we'll run your day. Okay. Also, I don't... I don't know how I feel about... Um, um, about Hitler. Um, I always forgot with that polka, whatever. Hitler polka. Yeah. Whatever that song was called. Also, yeah, that reminded me that I put this meme in a different chat. I I I understand, man. Like, hold on. I think I actually have that one as an MP. I said the glad I cast the Jews. God damn. <laughs> God damn it, Henry. Right, Ruby, I said a glass of juice, not Ruby. cast the juice. Ruby, here is a meme. Another Lego City meme. Oh no. Oh no. Why did you do. Why did you. Um, a man has. Why did you, oh my god. A man has been spotted okay, protesting in Lego City. Start the new military tanks. Chinese noise. Build the tanks and watch Tiananmen Square. Bring in the soldiers, censor the media, and run over the students. The new Tiananmen Square collection from Lego City. A man has been rejected from art school in Lego City. Oh, no. Bio, grow weird mustache, and remilitarize the Rhineland. Violate the Treaty of Versailles. Treaty of Versailles. Commit unspeakable war crimes and escape to South America. The new World War II collection from Lego City. Oh my god. <laughs> Hey, a man, a man is wearing a MAGA hat in Lego City. Hit him with the new, with the new bike lock. Wait, the guy, wait, the the bike lock guy hit like a random like um peace bringing dude. Yeah, he, bike lock. Dude, that guy was fucking. Yeah, he just hit a random asshole. dude, and he got. He yeah, oh, he wasn't even a random dude. He was like yeah. in between like the Antifa like horde and like the SJW horde, and he was like trying to keep the peace, and then a pass. Well, the Antifa guy that did that was actually a freaking um, professor. Oh yeah, no, um, no, like no, was like uh, a, was a, a university. A political ethics. Yeah. yeah, professor. Yeah, that's yeah, that's the kind of person you want teaching yeah. ethics, isn't it? Property in Lego mm -hmm. City. Oh no, he's, he got cut for shizzle. Yeah, that's the yeah. kind of person I want teaching my kids about ethics. Yeah, but if you disagree with someone, want... smack him in the head with a black lock while covering your face. Oh yeah. A man I, that's I just like, passing like to your it. private property in Lego Cities. Send the McNuke. <laughs> Build the McNuke and protect your property. Mine the Bitcoin. Command your child workers and get profit. The new anti capitalism collection from Lego City. Okay, Sid. Yeah, I like these. Uh, no, Sid, um, no, Sid, um, Ruby. A river has fallen Capistan. into a... You have three actions for the day. My father was an ANCAP. And a gamer. 
fucking love that. Um, hmm, what should I do? I have two days, right? Or just one day? Big button? Three uh, actions. Three actions. Okay. Um. Basically, it's, it's split into like six hour yeah. shifts. Should I think? Yeah, I was gonna say if I want to do shifts or if I want to do training. What can I train in? Let's look at my sheet. Uh, it depends on what you want to train, really. Um, there's lots of training materials that AIDS has, and all you need to do is just designate what you want to do, and he can supply the learning materials. Although, if it's a physical thing, you may need physical parts as well. Yeah. Could I train in communications? Uh, no. Uh, okay. That's, that's a, that's a core skill. Basically, you can um, do it for supplementary skills, but not core skills. Huh. Oh, well, I'm only one point away from biology training. I could finish that up. Um, yeah. Why not? Mm, yeah. Um, I'll try that then. Alrighty. Basic roll or what? Um, D20, yes. E. Ooh, shit. Yep, you failed to... That's a bit of um, boost your training back all right i'll try the second one second one i'll probably do one more shot at it and regardless of the outcome i'll probably use the third yeah roll that nat like 20. Shift. 12. Um, yep um what level are you at now um on I'm at that. Two. and that was for but your I, that was for your biology. getting too used to your body wasn't it e yep um, I'm gonna say you're now fully used to your body. Oh, nice. Right, so outside of your then... mech, you will no longer suffer any penalties on movement. Nice. And it will add um, a plus one to your stripping and seduction rolls for ones that would be attracted to you. Okay. So let's see here. Uh. Wait, would that be part of the the whoring or performance? Um, <sighs> as terrible as those are. Both. Oh, okay. It will give you. Um, it will basically give you a boost in attracting customers. So, like for the first one, I have a D twenty plus two plus one, and then I'd add another one. Uh, yeah, D twenty plus two. Yeah. Oh, it's a D. I already have a D plus two plus one. Well, um... To that specific role. Yeah, because that's communication, two, so now it'll be a D20 plus four in total, but plus two, plus two. Oh, yeah, because the second, the one is... Okay, so turn yeah, the one cause, into Yeah, um, because the first plus two is for your communications. The second plus two is now oh, for your dick package and your ability to move properly so you don't look very cl clumsy. So the first one should be taken to a three since I have three communications, right? Yes. And then the second one from one to a two. Nice. Yes. So now so attracting customers and stripping. Five. Yep. So nice. Yeah. So attracting then, customers, dancing, stuff like that. And and the and the performance. It only has a plus two. That was only my communications, right? Um. Yeah. Yeah. Performance. Oh no, that was. Ho I'm pretty sure that was horning and sex craft. Yeah, that's right. So I'm Does not, that also go up with biology training? Um, let me just have a quick look at your sheet. Um, yeah, okay, yeah. Because oh, I'm, yeah, don't forget to um, create your second character as well when you get a chance. Oh, yeah, okay. Um, I will, I'll I'll probably talk to you about that. I want to yep. talk to you. No problem. Um, biology training, three or three. So that gives you a plus two. Whoring and sex craft. That will allow that. Medical skills, zero... You had implants? Yeah, I remember. My implants are, was a thick package. Oh, oh yeah, that's... Sorry, implants are different to, um... That. Uh... Implants are kind of like, um... Um... Oh, like, like, uh, like um... Bi like, like, biotech. Yeah, biotech. Like, they'll insert, like, something into your... I remember we um, just put it on temple. there as too, because... Yeah, so put that on the. Um, put that on. Um, actually, I'll rename that personal biology training. 
So basically, that would be um. So you know your body really well. Uh huh. I know where it more enhanced by. And I'll put and I'll put your implants back to zero. Oh, okay. And then, so then for performance, it only stays at a plus two, or what, what does? is that? I always oh, actually, if yeah, no, that only increases with my horning sex craft, so that that doesn't change. Yep. The roll for performance. So yeah, no, I guess um, I'll use my third turn as to work a shift. Alrighty, no problem. Um, roll us um, communications plus whoring and sex craft. Yeah. Okay, twenty one. Okay, Holy you. Holy shit! Okay then. Um, unnatural twenty one. Okay, let's just see the kind of pickings that are around. Okay, there's not a lot Bruh. of good pickings. However, I'm going to give um, advantage on that roll. Okay. Um, despite really putting yourself out there, you're swinging your body around like you like you wouldn't believe. But sadly, there's no customers in the room. Bruh. You know, you go yeah. out there, you're like, I'm bringing my A game, you know. There's no one in the fucking club. Yeah. Damn, okay then. However, um, I am going to fudge again. these rules since that's a decent one. Um, you do manage to find um, 50 credits in the couch cushions. I find 50 credits just, okay, alright, 50 bucks. You're like, ah, oh, there's no cool. one around, I might as well search the cushions to see if there's anything good in here. And you're like, hey, 50 credit shit, awesome. So you plug it into your little <laughs> thing, and bang, you've got your an extra 50 credits. Nice. All right, I just added those. Okay. Um, now, well, Kamiko, I, I, we will roll the dinner um, section. Where do you want to go? Didn't, didn't I still have an action? Or... Oh, yeah, you, sorry, you got your day actions. That's right. Um, yes. So you got your two yes. day actions, and then your final... Action. Um, I want to take a look at the communist uniform. Alrighty. What do you want to do with your communist uniform? Uh, determine where it's from. You made it. You know where it's from. No, no, no. I, I mean, what lab it's, This is this is from really early on when we searched the uh, crashed ship. This is not actually mine. It's ah. someone who, who I, I rolled a twenty, so I found it in exactly my size, but it's not mine. Yep. Um, it is basically someone who was um, not so much like um, more of a representative of the Communist Party. Um, they're designed to basically go in there and act almost a bit like a commissar for people that are from the Communist section of the Federation. Can I determine which planet specifically, or...? Earth. Cool. The communists all come from Earth mostly, and then the rest are kind of like, um, sympathizers, but they're not official. You're kind of like, they're Federation first, communists second. Okay, so... But basically... A, a lot of commissars and stuff like that are communists, because they don't really have a lot of sympathy for people that would desert or disagree. Can I then find the, um, which country specifically? Like, which area of the world? Okay, let me just bring up a world map quickly, and I'll... Let me just do a quick, um, rule... F uh, not a rule fudge, but, you know, um... Ah, yeah. oh, there we go. Okay, roll me a d20. Is there any modifiers? Mm -mm. This will just determine which um, country. Okay. Two. Oh, okay, let me just get this up. Um... 
It looks like the guy is from Belarus. Belarus? Okay. Yes. I'm going... Well, this well is, from this the Belarus state. Um, it's not really... You know, most of Europe is basically communist except for um, England and a couple of other places um, which are part of the Commonwealth. But most of Europe is the communist um, state. Okay, so it's a Belarusian uniform. I'm, I'm putting that in yep. in, to, in front of my thing. Yep. Well, it's actually well, Belarus, Latvia like. combined. All right. Uh, Belarus dash Latvia. Yes. Uh, do I know what, what their pistol would look like? Standard issue. Okay. So I'm going to need to get a standard issue one then. Um, you do. That would be your normal pistol that you got at the start. Um, okay. With the exception that it may... Um, like the pistol will, is just stock standard but this um, outfit basically has the small little um, Belarus state or Belarus Latvia state badge um, okay. yeah, on I the think, inside I of the collar so that's I, where it came from I think my pistol is actually labeled as an underground one ah. so I might need to get a second one yep well you'll know basically you'll have to roll to basically create an imitation marking on it well that that's fine i'll just get a second one and then do that yeah but that can be later how many actions was that that was one action all right in that case then i'll go how much does a pistol cost like a standard one uh one thousand credits i do not have Damn. that much money i'll have to do it later i guess no problem. Well, wait, how much money do you have? Can we go? 880. Oh, okay. I tell you what, if you want, you can find um, an off market brand for 700. Uh, I'll hold off on that. Alrighty. I, I need to have enough money to actually be able to pay for dinner. No problem. Alrighty. Now it comes to your dinner with Picard. Um, where would okay. you like to go? You can go to the upper section, um, uh, or you can go to the to, um, under section. We agreed to casual, so which one has the best casual restaurant? Um, they both have reasonable ca um, thing, it just depends on the quality of food that you want to go to get. The upper section has uh, better quality food, but you are more in the open, so you will be monitored and stuff like that. The under section, you're less monitored, but the food's a little bit not as good. I'll go under. Alrighty. Um, so, where do you want to go? You got um, Cantina, um, if you want, or you can go to the strip club, or you can go uh, to the, um, just the, basically the... A standard restaurant, which would be around here, where Sid was take has uh, taken uh, her dates. The standard restaurant was expensive as fuck, from what I remember. So I'm gonna canteen. Cantina, no problem. Yeah, I don't think I have the money to be able to afford a 700 credit bottle of wine that we don't even get the full bottle of wine for. Well, that was. Don't forget, Sid did ask for the. Um, for the girls to choose what they wanted. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, I'm not going to be ordering for him, so... Okay. I'll just put that in Cantina. Alright, where did I put mine? I'm over here. So you basically you're taking, a, taking him to your um, workplace that you occasionally go to. Pretty much, yeah. Alrighty. Alright. Okay, he rocks up in um, his casual officer clothes. Because he really doesn't um, have any proper... Like, he hasn't really 
gone out and brought any new clothes. He's just kind of got his officer clothes that he's normally wearing, but he's wearing it very casually. You know, he hasn't got the jacket buttoned up and stuff like that. Yep. Man. What casual clothes do I have? Good question. I think... I believe you got lacy underwear, if I remember correctly. Uh... Or did Sid yes, grab them? Um, uh, I gave them to Sid. I don't know if Sid actually took them. I think Sid took them. But, uh, let's see. So, uh, I'll say probably like a tank top or something and jeans. Alrighty. Um, Just standard engineer stuff. Okay, roll us a d20. Alright. 20. Yep, um, you managed to find that there's... Um, in the cryopod says somebody's got some casual clothes set up in exactly your size. So you just managed to grab it from um, one of the others. Alright. I'm gonna... Give, give me a second, I need to do a cough. However, remind me about this so then um, if someone rolls a female character um, next time, um, they may end up hopping out of the thing without any clothes. Um, to put on. Yes. I, I'll probably return the clothes after. Yeah. Okay. Ignore the stains. It's a sweaty yeah. job. <laughs> anyway. So, we sit down. Yep. Okay, you're currently sitting thing. you got waitresses moving around. Just casually doing their job. All right. What's now, the order? Um, it is basic, basic food. Um, there's Nutra paste, and then there's a few other things like um, Bantha steak and stuff like that. All right. What's the cheapest piece of real meat, like actual meat? Oh, you want actual meat? Um, well, you'll get a um, place discount, so you'll get a twenty um, percent discount since you work here. While you're still on the books, anyway. Um, roll us a d20 again. Alright. 12. Okay. Yep. Um, it'll cost you about 100 credits for the two of you to get um, some good meat. Alright. Well, so at least you believe that it's meat, anyway. Well. Alright. It is kind of labelled impossible. The impossible meat. Oh, not that shit. Fucking goddamn it. Whatever. It's fine. It's fine. Alrighty. You go, um, it comes to you. It's um, cooked quite well. Um, let me just see how it turns out. Yep, it is very average, but it is but it's edible. All right. Any fancy drinks he's having, or? Um, no, he's just ordered a standard beer. I've just gone with water. Okay. He's like, so, what did you want to talk about? Well, I've got a few questions. Ask away. But uh, first, first off, thanks for thanks for taking over. I, I owe you one for that. No problem. That's, that's my over here. I mainly took over because it's a rank issue. Well, if I'm going to be completely honest, I was... I, I think I did acceptable given the conditions, but I probably was very close to... Uh, very close to being re forcibly removed from command, so... You Understandably. came in at the right time. Understandably. I'm not going to say anything about that. So, why exactly are you uh, in this? What, what? Why are you flying around on a ship, given your rank and the amount of experience you have? It's my way of life. I don't really know any different. Yeah, fair enough. I would have expected someone of your age to uh, have already settled down training the next generation, but 
He's like, no, I, I did settle down for a short time. Well, I slowed down for a short time, but circumstances beyond my control brought me back. Good or bad? Bad. Mm. Um, roll me a D20 plus communications to see, or, or skill. Um, Just 15. Yep. Uh, unless unless you count tech as that, in which case it would be plus. Oh no, uh, we'll go with communication because this will be basically a memory check of what you read on okay. his file. Fifteen. Yep. Um, you remember basically, without him telling you, that he was married and had some kids, but the wife um, passed away and the um, kid was lost in battle. Uh, Actually, no. He died during training. Sorry. Oh, well. Because Federation training is quite dangerous. You have to earn your right to be part of the Federation's uh, main force. Yeah, I'd imagine so. So... It has about a... Um, um, 10 to 15% success rate. Most quit, some, and an occasional person does die. Okay. Is he going to follow up on the thing um, after he says that? Or? Roll me a D20 plus communication to see if you can coach it out of him. Fucking Christ. No, he, does, he doesn't want to talk about it. Fair enough. You know, you lean in, oh, tell me more, and he's just like, oh, I'm not going to talk about it. The pa He says, the past yeah. is best left in the past. Maybe. But there's a lot about the past that's important, isn't there? He's like, yes, but personal past, you want to keep it in the past. Fair enough. I don't let he's like I Is don't let the past compromise my future or my ability to captain. Alright, has we got anything else? Has we got any questions or Um yes, he asked what brings you to wanting to fight on the front lines? Uh well uh, to put it simply, I'm about a third of my way th of the way through my life, and I'm I, I intend to go home. Third way, your average lifespan is going to be about 120 years. Evidently, you don't live where I live. He's like, oh yeah, I remember you're from Ukraine. Or the Ukraine state, yeah. I should say. Well, it's it, it's on their property. Whether or not I'm, whether or not I would call it from there, is or actually owned by them is another matter entirely. He's like, well, everything in Ukraine and the communist um, collective is. Owned by the Communist Party. Well, evidently they missed a few things, then. Well, so you believe. Or so they believe. Because it's hard to tell yep. with Communists. Yep. We, uh... I'm, I'm out here proving my, uh... To, to essentially... Find my way and come home... And an actual member of an actual member of my uh, community. Very well. As is uh, as has been tradition for generations. Yep, traditions does keep everything alive. Yeah. That that's why I asked you uh, what you were doing out uh, serving on the 
in the middle of nowhere because where I'm from, you would have retired and well, most people don't make it to 50 in our society, so you'd have presumably been an elder. A very uh, revered position. Let's see if you can remember anything from your thing. He was like, yeah, um, let's see, now I'm trying to remember. Sorry, I'm trying to remember a lot of stuff here. multi be doing stuff. Um, yeah, he's reasonably intrigued by what you're saying. Yeah, I'll be right back. No problem. Does he say anything else, or...? Um, no, he's more or less just kind of um, eating his food, nursing his beer, and kind of just listening to you moderately intently, but not overly intently. He's trying to put on the air that he is intently listening, but you can tell, kind of see a bit through it that he's just kind of going through the motions. Yep. Well, that's... Anyway, that's the point. I'm getting my skull collection up. I need a minimum of ten before I can go home and be considered successful. He's like, oh, you're from the um, Skull Collector cult. Cult is a bit strong of a word. Well, that's basically what it says on the on your sheet, on your, you know, on your cat, on your service right up. In a sense, they oh. kind of see you, um, your coal, um, slash background, almost a bit like they saw the Sikhs in World War One and Two. Hmm. You know, you're a bit weird, you're unorthodox, but you get the job done. So they really like putting well. people like you on, like yours on the front line a lot of the times. Well, no, no, I'm not, I'm not taking this one. You, you fucking called it a cult. I'm going, no, this is, this is an honorable tradition. It's like, oh yeah, tradition, but um, each religion slash stuff like that, they're, unless they're, um, part of the Federation officially, like officially um, sanctioned by the thing, is classed as a cult. So they'll be like the Buddhist cult. Um, the um, what's the other one? Like the Norse cult, stuff like that. Hello. Welcome back. I'm heavily, in that case, I'm heavily disappointed in the Federation. Well, the Federation is basically a meritocratical, um, almost atheist kind of um, group. But they do allow, they tolerate certain religions. Like, by law, they have to tolerate Islam because that's got um, a large section of Earth, um, which controls most of Africa, lots of India, and some of Europe. Just like in real life. Yeah. And then there's the Communist Collective, and then there's the Commonwealth. Which are the three factions yeah. on Earth. But they're all under the umbrella of the Federation. In that case, I'm going to ask him, is that, is that all he sees or says? Just insane cultists. He's like, well, you're a very small organization. For lack of a better word, you know, forests of Ukraine, and that's pretty small. It's a very small area when compared to Earth, and even smaller when you compare it to the wider galaxy. And yet, we bring immense honor to those we kill, isn't that? Yes, as is your way of life. Or so I've read about. Well, it's nice to see you You at least read the briefing. Of course, I had to read the briefings on every crew member. Good. 
Alrighty, um, he has finished his meal and so have you. I do have a question about what his future plans are. His future plans. Roll us a communication to see if you can um, coach them out. I'll be right back. No problem? Five. Okay, and... Yeah, he's like, uh, my future plans are my own. But for now, I will continue to captain the ship for as long as I can. For as long and as in that case, I will support you in this endeavor. He's like, that's good to hear. If I have anything that's coming up, um, I'll rely on your support. And he says, don't let me down in the future. I just... Uh Give him a thumbs up. Actually, can I can I use my fancy tech arms to give him multiple thumbs up? Your tech arms only have one set, of, one thumb. No, no, I mean like um, basically to well, then use what's the, the point things like having them. God. No, no, Slavitz, Slavitz. I mean more like a. You know how um, when I if I were to use them, I would basically have part like little probes come out of the arm. Uh, yes. What? Can I can I make do a thumbs up and then have more of them join in as a th yeah. thumbs up? Roll us a d20 plus tech. All right. D20 plus four. Seventeen. Yep. You put both hands up. Put your thumbs up, and then the thumbs split into like four thumbs. Pull them out. And you wriggle them back and forth as they kind of split and become individual like um segments of a thumb. Yeah. What exactly does the captain think of this little show of um, of um, technological superiority? Okay, let's see how he look, feels about it. He's moderately impressed by your um, mastery of your robot arms in such a short time. Nice. And let's see, plus social... Though he is socially confused on why you would do it. <laughs> what Don't, worry. Don't worry, just... If you need someone that needs killing, let me know. Yep. He gives you a formal nod. And he stands up. I will follow suit. Okay. After I've paid and everything. Yeah, um, these places work on the same style of an Australian system, so there's not not really tipping. You go up and you you pay before you get your product. All right. I guess I've already paid. Then that's good. Yep. You really don't like dine and dashing down there, huh? No. Well, Australia doesn't have any tipping or anything, so if you go in and order really? a meal, you literally go, okay, um, okay, that hamburger's $10, here's $10, I'd like a hamburger. And they're like, okay, we'll take your $10, we'll give you the, and then we'll give you the hamburger, and then you can go eat at the table, or you can um, take it away. Huh. You know who else is to have, um, doesn't believe in tipping? Japan. I don't blame them. I think well, Japan. Like, I think in Japan, tipping is actually seen as um, yeah, like um, an insult almost. Yeah, like like straight up. When I was working at um, my old job, um, I got a few tips, but it was always very weird. Like over here, it's uh -huh. very abnormal that someone would tip someone. Ah, interesting. Because yeah, yeah, it's it's a social it's thing here. You know, here you, uh -huh. you pay for your product, you get the product, and then that's it. Well, I think in America mm -hmm. and Canada and stuff like that, you know, you go there, you order your meal, you eat your meal, and then you pay afterwards. Which yeah. never really and makes then, sense, because then if you're like, oh, fuck, I haven't got bill. enough money for it. You know? And yeah, you, uh, that's very, it's very easy to, like... like you, you're frowned upon and looked as an asshole. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And there's literally, like, on a bill, there's usually a tip, and... 
the the cordial thing is like twenty five percent, twenty twenty or thirty percent. Sometimes uh, no, people no. put like fifteen though. Fifteen is the standard. That is what? No way. Twenty five is the standard. No, no. Fifteen is what is expected. If you do above fifteen, then you don't look like such an asshole. See, I've always thought, you know, you set the price, you get paid the money, that price. You shouldn't be yeah. Yeah, no. expecting more really? after, like... Really? Why? It's really about their performance. Like, if they do a really well, shit job, yeah. they are really slow, they don't give me my food on time, and then my food's not prepared well, and has a bunch of fuck-ups, and yeah, I'm not going to give them a very high... Well, normally, um, when you order 15, food or something like, like that, you get a receipt. And if you don't get it on time oh, yeah. or something like that, you just go up and say, listen, my food's not on time, refund. And they'll they'll just go, okay, it's either coming out right now or here's um, a discount or a refund. Yeah, no, here a tip is expected. Now, if your service is terrible, 5%, 2% at most. Yeah. But the reason why it's expected now is because a server is not paid minimum wage uh. they're actually paid under minimum wage see that that is stupid should be um set wage set price and just it's a lot simpler well that's the way it i is, see it anyway but that's not how it works here for some dumb reason you well, that's because it's a culture and whatnot of tipping so i don't you know this question if you buy a car do you have to tip freaking 15% on what you've paid for the car? Nah. No. Well, mm, yeah. well, when you're buying a car, the salesman that sold you that car is getting a permit. Uh, uh, they're getting uh, a um, portion the, of what you paid for uh, the car. Mm. A sales uh, commission. Commission. Yeah. A commission, yeah. Yeah, they work on commission. But, All salesmen do, I'm pretty sure. All salesmen, oh, yeah. But. Well, they don't work on commission. They get a base rate and they get a commission bonus. Yeah. Oh, that's what I meant. Like, they work. Like, the majority. But I'd imagine a good lot. They, they're they going to make a lot more money if they do well. Mm -hmm. So it's practically like working on commission because, you know, if you ain't getting a lot of shit done, then you ain't making a lot of money. And so you basically ain't making any money. Mm. Basically. <laughs> Alrighty, um, unless you want to talk to him any about with anything anymore, he's going to head off. Uh, let's see, do I have anything? Um. Actually, roll me a d20 plus communications. So just a d20 then. Right. Yep. Four. Okay. And now roll me one more d20. Oh, you can't beat a nat 20, though. You feel a little bit gooey around him now. <laughs> as he gives a very official salute and a warm smile towards you. <laughs> he will be in your dreams Gross. tonight. <laughs> That's fine. Oh, that is too perfectly funny. fine. Yeah, well, that's fine. That's that's significantly better than rolling and getting horny around Shadow. I'll take it. <laughs> Actually, I am going to just um, screen cap that so then um, I remember for later on. Does, does he does he have um, similar? Did he roll similarly? Um, let's see. Um, dresses are so cute. yes. A little bit, but you seem to be more infatuated with him than he is with you. That's fine. That's that, out of character fine. knowledge, but yes. So yeah, there's the rolls. Oh. Well, metagaming. On the right. So cheap, so cheap. So basically what you're, you're saying is uh, we've, we've combined and now we're... So, no, well, basically, yeah, this, this um, if this keeps going, it'll go to basically flirting, and then you probably going to his um, bed chamber without him even knowing it. Uh, um, actually, 
you head back to your ship, you go to your room, everybody's in the ship at the moment, sleeping. Um, roll us one more d20, Kamiko, with a minus one. Ten. Okay. You feel the urge to um, swipe something from his room, but you manage to maintain your composure. Alrighty, the day has ended. I'm, and I'm not stealing his heart. He only has one. Put heads down. No, don't, don't put your heads down. That's that's my. That, that's that's just asking for a good old chop. Yeah, we all know. What? No, we all Have know you that you're supposed to um, make keep eye contact. What? No, yeah. maintain you eye the contact. Day is over. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just saying he's saying he's keeping his head down. down. It's, just, it's like, you don't and keep then, your heads down, remember. Make mafia, eye, keep eye contact. Up. Who keep are you going to kill? <laughs> Do, um, put your heads down. Yeah. Or, and no, it's doctor. Um, uh, everybody go to sleep. And then uh, Mafia, um, wake up. Who are you going to kill? And then they point. Man, if y'all didn't play Mafia, y'all are lame. Oh, um, it's been I a while, actually. I played so. Mafia. We played... Um... Oh, the yeah, there's a version. version. Yeah, um, uh, Salem, I think it's called? No, no, it's, uh, I actually have the app. Oh, no, sorry, there's so Salem, and then there's, uh, the, um, yeah, I know, it's, I think it's just called Werewolf, right? Where you have the werewolf, well, the dark, not the yeah, werewolf, not Werewolf, Darkness, hunt. um, White Wolf or something, isn't it called? Yeah, that, but it's, it's the same one where everybody, like, sits in a, in a circle, right? Yeah, And you yeah. have, like, Two werewolves, like one doctor, like one detective, or at least I guess in that case a word. I don't know what it is, but in mafia, it's two mafia, a doctor, and a detective. Okay. Uh, well, well, one thing you don't want is um, Kamiko in a circle with you. <laughs> Why not? Don't we sit in a circle a lot when it comes to planning? No one's getting that joke. Mostly because I don't want to imagine. I would hope that that's never ever a situation all our characters find ourselves in. In which we, in which I get to steal your heads. No, when we jerk off in a circle. Oh. At least oh. Ruby gets that's the a joke. joke is making. Yep, that's the joke Lavitz is making. Cause he's gross. Of course. Oh. Well. Holy anyway, because in this um, group I'm the dirty old man. <laughs> <laughs> that's it, bro, yes. that's cringe. Yes, you are. You are. Yes, bro, that's cringe. Anyway, anyway, we're we're doing good. This is this is oh, good. Wow. You know what this means, Lavitz? What? It means we're bros. Uh, at is the it, moment, it, you're feeling that you're. If you don't play your cards right, you'll get friend zoned. <laughs> You feel your bond Please don't with friends him me. He now feels close. He yeah, now feels close. That's and still, fart that's still you. better. That's still better than look. All right, the only human crew member likes me. That's good. Kamiko will remember I like this. You. What the fuck, bro? I think I said cool. only human. Fuck you. I'm human enough. No, you're not. You're humanoid. You're not yeah. a human either. You're a subhuman too. That's not true. Yeah, you are. You are subhuman. You know why? Culturally you're fucking, subhuman. I'm that, you're that third world country looking ass. Yeah, culturally subhuman. Not even culturally. <laughs> you're just subhuman in general. So yeah, Look, well, it does take part in the underworld. All right, you. Mm -hmm. If you die, I'm just saying that head. That that head's mine. Yeah, and if you die, I'm just saying, it's, you're not getting a burial. Kamiko's internal yeah, quest fine. for head. You don't worry, Ruby. Uh, you'll, 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 you'll see. You'll see what happens gross. when I die with my second character. We'll see how that goes. Yeah. I'm sure I will retard. Now remember, um, when you roll up a second character, if you're an ab, an ab human or um, something along that lines, or a demi human, so to speak, um, you have to play a human. If you played a human, you have to play a non-human. I know, love. It's I've got an alien character. Yeah, no, no. I'm just telling um, Ruby because I don't think I've told you. Wait, that, so, Ruby. 
So yeah, I don't think you play, wait till I'm gonna you're playing. You're playing. You're playing a Quarian at the moment, yeah. which is um, a non-human race. So it's an alien race. Yeah. So that means the next mm. character you roll up must be a human. Oh, okay. Yeah, and I've gone. Okay. I was already thinking about human ones, but I wasn't quite sure. It's basically um, what I should do to put a bad word on it. I call it um, the shadow rule. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, he's such a cock lavit. Um, it's mostly what just it to is, keep Shadow from doing horses again. Yeah, it's basically so Who that. Who gives shits? Because um, mainly it was set up for Netherworld Dragoons, so it was to make it that if you play a, char a certain race, um, when you mm -hmm. play another one, since it's a testing game, or an alpha yeah. or an a beta. Um, I want the races to be tested. So if you're just going to play the same race over and over again, it's not testing the system. You know, there's a bunch of other uh, races that are untested. So basically, wait, so, so that, that if you play a dev, like, testing games. Um, well, this is a testing game as well. Um, this is? is this is huh. using this is using um, Netherworld Dragoon System um, 1.5, which I, is still the like this is. The Alpha Space Game, um, and soon I'll be work. Um, uh -oh. Soon um, the Beta Dragons or Two Point O will be starting, because this whole game and system and stuff is still in its early stages, so it needs to be tested as much as possible. But uh -huh. basically, with um, if you played like um, a tech character last time, like this time, um, when your new character roll up, you can't play a tech. You'll have to play like a sniper or a frontline fighter. Because I want each, mm. like, multiple version, like, characters and whatnot to be played. I know it's a bit, you know, mean and forceful, but, you know, if you play, say, I'll use Sid for an example, but say, Sid, you've played a Roper in the other game. In the next game, um, yep. you might play a Goblin or a Slime or a Snake or something like that. But you won't be able to play a uh, Roper. <laughs> yes, yeah, I'm, I'm just using that as an example. Uh -huh. Yeah. And it's just so that, you know... And also the players can get a wider variety of um, playing different creatures. And stats and play styles. Because mm -hmm. otherwise... Like, um... If I was in a D&D &D game playing as a thing, I always play as a caster. But I would, but it would probably would be a smart idea for a DM of me, like someone who was DMing a game for me, um, that they'd say, all right, you've played a caster, now play a bloody um, something different. Barbarian or yeah. something. Yeah, a barbarian or a, or a bard sense. or something along that line. I just think you should name something else, you big bully. It's just a suggestion. I'm not going to overly enforce it, but I would prefer it, so to speak. Did you hear what I just said? You kind of cut out, sorry. Oh, I said that makes a lot of sense. I'm just saying you should name it something else, you big bully. Well, it was mainly set up basically for Shadow in the initial stages, and that was just kind of like um, a joke that... Um, um, Ray came up with, I think. He keeps fucking playing horses. Yeah, he's always got to play a horse, man. Yeah, because that's what he likes to play. That's a character he enjoys. Oh, yeah, but this is a testing game. a fucking role about him. Yeah, no, no, I'm not... This is rude. I'm not being mean like about that it. Like, you, you question why he seems irritated and difficult a lot of times. That's because he always feels like he's attacked. Because he's a horse. <laughs> Should have should have horse phobia. No, you. It is anyway. equine phobia. No, you. It is equine phobia, good sir. It is anyway, legitimately recognized phobia. We're back on the ship. Yes. Um, you're back on the ship. Um, yeah. and you're all sleep, and it is now thirteen days into RCL warps. All right, we've got two ships to kill, boys. Let's do it. All right. For it, girls, and yeah, no, we're all girls. <laughs> yep. Now, if you girls want, you can do cat. another um, thing on in the station, or you can head out, or basically whatever you guys want to do, as long as there's a consensus, we'll do. Uh, 
Well, there's still, what, two more ships? Two more. Two more ships, and, and the big ship still needs clearing out. Yeah. However, um, everybody roll me 1d20. Three. And ten. And fit okay. If I'm gonna be honest, I don't think the big ship is as much of concern as the little ones because we removed the brain. Like they can't make a new one probably because they don't have anything to build on. We we should still clear it out, but mm -hmm. it's less worrying. Okay. Everybody add three thousand and eleven dollars to your credits each. Uh, why? Because basically that's what you've managed to, that was salvaged from the ship that you cleared out last time. Ah, nice. Three thousand and what? Eleven. Three thousand, oh, just eleven bucks straight, alright. Yes. So, nine, ten. Nice. Okay. Okay. I have this Luxia. This what? I said I have this Luxia. Ah, this Luxia. <laughs> mm -hmm. I've got Echoprexia. What's your point? <laughs> what does that mean? It means that occasionally oh, Sidney yeah. will repeat things. No, this, this, maybe, do you get the joke? Yeah. But no. it's dyslexia, but you know, of course, you can't you're spell reading it yeah, incorrectly so. because you have dyslexia. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I did. That, I'm saying I had that because I put 69 instead of 96, <laughs> which is a much better number. But sadly, yeah, I have 96, <laughs> not 69. Haha, <laughs> sex yeah. number. How bad you you miss your giggity chance. Anyway, should we go kill? Should we go kill the other ships? Yeah. Discuss. Alright. Ruby, how are you? What do you think? Let's go, uh, um, so pillage, now. murder, and rape. Let's All right. go, Sefa, now. I'm, I'm on board for too. Let's get more heads, boys. Okay, let me just. I'm four away. Okay. Um, this one here is fully salvaged. Okay. I think we need to clear this one out and that one this can't one be salvaged. Down. That one can't be salvaged. This one is finished salvaged, so is this one. So yeah, now you've got a choice of this one here or this one there or the big one. I'd probably say uh, this one. I'm just gonna follow Nico. Alrighty. Yeah, I, I don't want I don't want either of the ships waking up. The big one, we killed the we we destroyed the brain, so it can't wait and attack. But the other two are probably having their actively be repaired. Okay. Roll me, uh, somebody roll me a D2. D2? Yep. Two. Okay. This ship is a bit more difficult to dock with. You can't really, um, actually roll me, um, Which way do you I want to enter? You can enter through the mouth, or you can cut a hole and enter through the back. Uh, so they hit it from the, the front or hit it from the back, alright. Yeah, it's the like mouth you is can where the brain is, isn't it? Um, uncertain. The last one had a brain near its mouth, yes. Yeah, so... That's, a prob that's probably a good one to pick, I'd say. But... The back would also be acceptable, I guess. I'm the back. You'll have to cut I'm your way in. Yeah, I kind of 
I kind of want to know why. All right. But I'm open to suggestion. Uh, I don't care. <laughs> So I, hmm. How about we? How will we do? How uh, we all? Uh, they always say to do it. Uh, uh, two in the pink and one in the stink. Um, you can only dock at one spot. Those. God yeah, fucking exactly. damn! Why you got the cock block me clapping? Well, it's basically you've got one tongue. Do you want to go for the pink or the stink? Pink. Alrighty then, so that will be the mouth. Because a tongue is pink. It doesn't stink as much as a butthole. It can stink as much as a butthole if it's been eating a lot of butthole. <laughs> that is true. That is true. Okay. Uh -huh. You. You. Um. Do you want to roll a pilot and check or do you want to let um, Picard do it? Uh. I've got plus four. Does he have larger than that? Um, not really. This is just kind of like an overall. Ten. Um, you managed to dock, but when you dock, the jaws kind of, um, you managed to, um, wedge it in into the jaws. And basically, as you do that, the jaws reflexively kind of bite down slightly on your, uh, the umbilical cord of the ship. And I've got your character, so fix up your HP. Um, you're yeah, all fully Ruby's healed. Beautiful. So, Ruby, you've got to put your shields back up and your HP back up. Oh, yeah, I was about to ask about that. Yep. Well, you're fully healed, I remember, didn't Where you? Where are we? Oh, there um, top yeah. center. I use one of my crystals. Yep, remember Where to mark that off. Now, remember, you can yeah. either use one of the alien oh, power no, cells or time. a patch crystal. Which I think you use an yeah, alien I use, power I use one of my. Yeah, I use my like bio one. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Uh, Yentin, and this area is dark, but it feels a little bit more. Lack of a better word, lively. I'm gonna observe. Yep. So Ruby, fix is... up your health. Yeah, I'm trying. I thought I saved it, but I didn't save because it's stupid. So that is D20 plus observation? Um, no, plus um, targeting. Okay, I get plus one for that. That's right, with robot eyes. Three. Okay. Wow. Yep, and Ruby, D20 plus targeting. Did you... Uh, it was just D20. Okay, you guys can't really see much. It is very dark. Um, Sid manages to switch to infrared for a bit to see quite a bit, but everything is hot in here. The area is, surprisingly enough, even though it's just suffered a slight amount of decompression when you attached, um, the mouth is sealed and atmosphere has returned, and it is giving off a lot of heat in here. Ooh, that's not good. And that is what you see. We should probably finish this quickly, yeah. Mm -hmm. The jaws are reflexively moving, crushing a little bit, releasing a little bit, crushing a little bit, releasing a bit. Almost ah, like um, a child sucking on a pacifier. You know, uh -oh. <laughs> but it's very slow, you know, it's like... Is over the course of a minute, it bites down a little bit and then releases it. All but right, it's still maintaining um, a reasonably good vacuum seal, but there is a slight amount of atmosphere that keeps getting sucked out. Mm. All right. Let's move quick. Mm -hmm. Wait, hold on. How much money did we get? Fuck, I forgot to put that down. It was um, 3,011. Alright, thank you. No problem. Okay, Sid, that you're advancing. That I okay, and let's see. I'm falling behind. Okay. Alright, beside. Ruby? Hello. 
Okay, yeah. I'd recommend you Definitely take looking at memes. the front. I'd recommend that you go to the front because, uh... Wait, I, how much shield do you have? I have five, but uh, overall, I have you have 38 health, I have 27 in total, and Sidron has 28. Excuse me, there. I have 31 health. Does that have 22, Kamekai? Uh, I said in total. Uh, I, I said in total, counting the uh, shield ah. health. Not actually. Yeah, I haven't increased it. Uh, don't worry, Lavitz. I'm not. I'm not tricking. Kamiko, I swear to God. I swear. To, I, sw I swear to God. Sure, God. Okay, roll us a d20 again, plus targeting, and we move forward. Oh. Me. Oh. Okay. As 20. you move in, suddenly your <laughs> um, your specs um, and your view screen start lighting up. Um. It's detecting that this ship is very much alive. In fact, it is ah. starting to power up slightly. Oh, you're killing me. scary. You're killing me. And you start hearing thumping, like something smashing on the ground. So it's like... <laughs> and suddenly okay. you see... Oh, it's going to... Damn it. You look forward... And you see a very large thing, and it seems to be working itself up into a very, almost like a rage. Sidron? Yep. Um, if you'd be so kind there is a number of workers kind of walking around that are showing up, and you see one of the one of the mine ones standing on top of. A brain chamber, but it doesn't look like it's assimilated into the brain. And everybody, roll me a d20. 16. Okay. okay. Uh. And then roll us turn order. Mm. Oh, I got a 20. Why do I always get a 20 on my GM rolls what that no one can yeah. Okay. Jesus. Also, why did I roll twice? I'm angry. Oh, and never mind. One of them. One of them was just for the normal roll, and then one of them was for um, turn order. Okay. All right. Um. Either way, uh, this guy so charges good. in at you, Ruby. Ah, hello there, you big Wait, faggot. Fuck, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Just to be. Fuck! I forgot to put my heal drone on the map. And it, you just managed to dodge out the way, so I'm going to put you there. <laughs> Wonderful. As it yeah. charges in and tries to just downright, just do a downward double smash on you. Smash. And you just yeah. and you dodge to the side. They're trying to pound me, my goodness. Okay. I should have brought my heal drone. Yes, you really should have. Okay, I'm just yeah. going to get turn order up. Yes. Yeah, this this has four attacks, so um Well no, he only he doesn't get four attacks. <gasps> oh. He's slow oh, but much more powerful. Now I'm gonna let you guys discuss strategy while I go for a quick piss again. Rub All right. uh, uh, close what? range one is probably highest priority. For all yeah, time. no, I, yeah. He looks very much um, melee kitted, so we're going to want to shoot it on him so that he dies very quickly. Uh, tell you what, I'm gonna post Ruby, take uh, a look in space rooms, please. Okay. Give it a second. Violence is never the answer. You already sent that. Well, I'm doing it again. This is, this is it, Ruby. We're doing it. We're committing violence. Oh my god. No, that's never the answer. The violence is a question, and the answer is yev. I'm gonna follow that up with, um, one that will take a bit longer to send. Hold on. I'm going to shid. I'm gonna cry. Piss your pants, maybe. Piss your pants, maybe. Maybe you shouldn't, shouldn't come. come. Potion seller, I require your strongest potions. Wait, wait, what? 
Oh, you, you missed that meme, didn't you? I'm, I don't know. I'm sorry, is it a doge meme? No. I don't give a fuck. Ruby, look at it. No, no. This calls for a very special blend of psychology and extreme <laughs> violence. Okay, then. He says, holding a fuckload of mines. This is an Fucking accurate assessment NCR. of every single game I've played ever. Yes. Fucking NCR. Ranger retard. All right, let's do it. I have you there. I don't think he's back yet. Okay, well, um, here's the plan. We kill this one, and then we kill this one. Mm -hmm. I don't Excellent strategizing there, my dude. Thank you. We don't... The, the big one is... You know, the big mind one, probably a good idea to shoot him, but at the moment, we've got the big boy right up close, so I want Ruby alive at the end of this because she has a lot of money and <sighs> we need to fix the ship, so... Also, she's nice. Uh huh. But mostly the money. Okay, I'm Shut back. the fuck up. You're such a bitch. Hello. That's yeah. true. I am. And you're an alien, so. Yeah. I'm you're doing this because I'm an alien, isn't it? Off the record? Yes. yes. But on the record, I did it for the money. <laughs> I don't know if that's going in motor, right then. The Simpsons. Mm. Oh, yeah, no. Yeah, I didn't see that one. Guess who? Anyway. Maris? Anyway, Lavitz. Yes! Uh, we've, we've got our strategy. It's pretty simple. We just shoot them until they die. A ah. bold strategy. She dooted them. Yep. <laughs> okay, then. It is Sid's turn. Sidron, if you would be so kind. Uh, yeah. Um, guess I'm gonna try with this. Ooh, nice. Very nice. I'm okay. not gonna use the mod, though. Very Let's hog. Take a look. Yeah, that, that pierce wouldn't have gone no. to this, so it's so, no. so it's worthless. Don't, don't use that. Okay, so I'm you're using, using the, the are you, you're using the alien one. I'm using the alien one without the mod. Would you be able to change the background, not the background, the text color of that at all? Because I can barely read that through the purple background. Wait, well, that's what? the thing. It's, it's supposed to be a GIF. Wait, which one? Wait, the thing that she just put in chat. Yeah, the one that she just rolled. For me, it's a white text on a black on a black background. It, it, I can read it perfectly. If fine. I highlight it, it goes white on purple, but is like dark black on dark purple for me. Huh, that's weird. Mm. For me, it's just white on black. Yeah, white text on a black reason. background. I don't know why. You steadily take your aim and fire your target. Three round cooldown mod piercing fifty feet. And half damage for each consecutive hit requires one for all um, per yeah. cell. Anyway, um... Okay, you hit it and it pierces into its armor. Um, you realize it does hit something fleshy behind its armor, but you realize that this thing is covered in really thick armor. Thick. Thick. Absolutely. It's like basically like you're trying to pierce through Ruby's um, character's thighs. They're just I mean, very thick. They're, they're, they're thick, but they're not exactly like high. Hey, you know, they're still so soft Sorry, and muscle. Fuck, fuck. So I hit the wrong button. That was not. God damn it! God damn it! I was trying to, I was, I was trying to deselect my character, and I hit turn order. So, fuck. Uh, well, it's okay because Shit. the turn order is already set. So. You are last on yeah. the turn order, so since yeah, I've already I was, I was last, it, so it doesn't matter. Yeah. Okay. Um, Sid, do you want to 
do a slight move at all, or do you want to sidearm it? Uh, I can move there, right? Um, you can move. I think it was five or something. Five or ten, ten I think, wasn't it? So yeah. two squares. <laughs> yep. Alrighty. It is Mr. Biggie Boo Bug Guy. And I forgot to set his health. Ten kills. And Okay. There we go. Okay. Get back up there. Get Why aren't you? This thing ain't lining up to the squares. Hmm. Weird. Oh, I think I know. There we go. There we go. Sizing issue. Okay. Roll me a d20, everybody. Oh, no. I just realized that I'm a complete retard. Jesus Christ. Oh, no. And sit d20. Okay, doubles roll again for Sid. Yep. Okay, everybody except Ruby is completely fine. You hear a couple echoes in the back of your head, but that's about it. Oh, Ruby, on the gosh. other hand... I wanna die. Roll me another d20. Sort of fuck. Severity. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. Let's go. I wanna die. All of a sudden, all your systems go haywire, and you start getting massive amounts of reing coming through your systems. Ah. And it is creating sound back um, reverberations through your entire mech. Your mech has ah. shut down, and you're just screaming in pain. Ah. Wonderful. And let's see. I want you to knock off Six health. Not even like shield. Nope. This is mental, um, personal damage straight to you. Shit. Six health. That would bring me to twenty-five. Yep. And you're going to be incapacitated to the next turn. Wonderful. I want to die. Okay. Ruby, it, Ruby, it is your like turn. Roll us a d20, Ruby. Oh, God. Oh, let's go. Oh, dead metal. Yep, um, you managed to, me. you managed, in your screaming in pain, you managed to punch inside your mech, and you've managed to shut down the internal speakers. You won't be able to communicate for the next turn with the teammate, but the sound has stopped. Mm, that's good. So that will stop, um, the... Um, more damage to you personally. That's good. Okay, it is the brute's turn. Turns to you, Ruby, and swings its fists at you, dealing five damage to you, to your shields. It then swings its fists again, dealing two damage. Oh, okay. And that, is, that is its turn. Kamiko, it is your turn. Miss. Miss. Okay. Wait. Um, why are you using your pistol and not your gun? Because I don't have a rifle. Because last time it exploded in my hands, and I can't, and I forgot about that. So I don't have one. That's right. And I'm not going to play you like that, Lavitz. I'm not going to play you like that. Well, what a gentleman it's, good, and a it's good to be honest like that. Okay, Sid, okay. it is your turn. Both of those were crit damages, too. Okay. 
Five killer pist um, rifle. Okay. And do you want to fire with your sidearm? Yep. Minus two. Um, you managed to hit him in a few of the spots that you managed to crack his armor Jeez. with the last round. So you did manage to do a decent amount of damage, but a lot of it is being neutralized by his very thick armor. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, let's see. D3. Oh, roll D6. One, two, three. Sid! Um, all of a sudden, a uh, blaster round comes flying at you. Hitting you for five damage. And you're taking an account of the maneuverability? Um, what was your maneuverability? Two. Two. So you need 12 or above yep. to hit me. I hit 12. Okay. And that was five? Yep, five damage to you. And Good. second shot rings out. A 14, so it hits you for four damage. Okay. Okay, Ruby, it is your turn. No, Ruby? it's not because it's, because I'm incapacitated. No, no, no. That was the last turn. This is the second turn. Oh, right. Um, roll us a okay. d twenty though. Huh? Yep, you managed to do a little bit of um, creative finagling with your thing. You've you got full communications back, and you're feeling fine. You got a bit of. That's good. Um, you think you may have taken some physical damage from the um, attack, but adrenaline has kicked in and you're feeling great. Mm. I'm going to give you a plus two to a hit on this um, turn. Thanks for that, 20. I'm going to fucking hit this big bastard. Alrighty. Pew, pew, motherfucker, pew, pew. <laughs> okay, huh? first hit. First one hits. Yes. And second one. Nice. Wait, I'll be right back. I've got a visitor. <laughs> okay. I'll wait for him to... Oh, roll the second one. Oh. Hmm. I'll get one damage. It hits pretty well, but... Only one damage. All right. Warning. Engaging multiple hostile titans. We're going to focus and fire on the weakest target. All right. Um, you, titan you managed to hit it. You do a good Recommend job. aggressive sustained counter fire. Okay. It is Brute's turn. And he swings again at you, Ruby. I swear to fuck. I'm um, hitting you for 10 damage. Oh no. And his Did second you? swing hits you for four. Oh, Jesus, I'm just taking the hits. I had Imagine full shield and full health. Imagine like how my drone felt. Imagine how my drone felt. It's the reason why that drone has like five health. My drone took four hits from this thing. It had like ten. Oh, never mind. Yeah. Yeah, this one appears to be a bit bigger than the last one. Yeah, mm -hmm. anyway. And it appears to be enraged. Oh, Speaking wonderful. of. Do you know what time it is, Lavitz? Missed on? Time for me to miss another crit damage. Oh, I'll wrap. And also to hit for two. Okay, there we go. Okay, Sid, it is your turn. It appears mm -hmm. to be quite damaged now. His armor is starting to crack. Oh. Roll us crit. It's a D15. Nice. Well, no, just roll it again. 
if you get another crit, then it yeah, just Lavitz roll the attack a second time. Crits. Yeah, Lavitz allows recursive crits, so... Yep. Um, with that, you manage to find a weak spot directly under its chin. So as it raises up to hit Ruby a third time, you fire it and you hit it straight under its chin. And the blast just shot, rings out and actually pierces through the roof a bit. Oh. And the okay. brute falls to the ground dead. All right, nice. he's got a pistol shot again. You know what to do. Yep. What is the range yep. on that? Because... That's a good question. Because the, Actually, yeah. because the pistol range is 60, so you will have a minus um, 2 to hit. Well, I think we're fine. Doesn't matter. Okay, you hit it and it shields flicker. Oops. Okay, it is now Big Guy's turn. Big Guy. And D6. One, two, one, two, three. Hey, it's firing at you again, Sid. Oh, no. Okay. It fires and hits you for one damage. One damage. Oof. It's second attack. Roll. I rolled a crit. Uh, That's one damage ooh. plus two damage. So an, an extra three oh, damage. So in total you take four damage. <laughs> oh wait, no, no, no. Man, Second no. crit. Second crit. Oh no. Plus eight He's damage. Dead, oh my god. Oh. You will not believe this roll I'm having. Mm -hmm. Is it okay. crit? Yes, I got three crits in a row. Holy mm. shit. I am going to... Um, print screen just to show you this. I've just eaten up everybody's luck for like probably the next 10 games. So let's see, that's so one, then, two, three, are four. Are we agreed on the uh, psychology and extreme 12, violence here? 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. That's 18 damage. Fuck. Okay. So I'm down to two. Is she dead? No, she's still alive. <laughs> But oh my God, look, look at that. That is literally... Um... Yeah. Three crits in a row. Yeah. Lavitz is Holy very good. Holy fucking shit, Lavitz. What the fuck, bro? Legit hacking. Okay, and that was its... Two attacks. Okay, Ruby, it is your turn. I want to shoot that big fucking cunt for hurting her so much. Uh, that's 70 feet away. Yep, so you take a, you'll take a minus one to hit. Yeah, you can just move up. I, I back, yeah, I'm just gonna... Um, move up uh, 10, and you'll be within range. I was about to say, how much can I move in one, in one of my moves? 15. 15. So, you'll be within range... Okay. Uh, you'll be within range there. So, it's your one it starts, movement to move yeah. forward, and another movement to shoot this big bitch. By the way, um, if you guys want, I will allow you to use this thing as cover. Oh, that's I, cool. I am not within range So, if you put your token to on top of it, I'll, I'll assume that you're basically um, hobbling around, hiding behind its arms or something, because this thing is massive. Let's see. Uh, Order was, I was about... Um, um I, I was about there, here. so I'll So I can move here, right? Yes. And that yeah. will give you I'll, um a plus that, two to yeah. basically dodge it. So I'll need to roll I'll a twelve. Move there. So alright. So and then so that's one move, second move I'm gonna shoot. Alrighty. Big bitch. Nice, Whoa. max damage. And its shields dissipate. Nice. Okay, Brute is dead. Kamiko, or Tekla, Tekla, your turn. Tekla, I'm moving all the way up, and that's my full turn because that's twenty. Okay, you know you could move so here, still get the cover. You'll have a minus one to hit, but you'll be able to. Yeah, but I'd rather take two shots full 
because I just move forward uh, one spot anyway. So I might as well just move the full and then take two shots without penalty. Yep. No problem. Okay, Sid, it is your turn. Mm -hmm. Alright. Not bad, oh, you're doing pretty good against two boss yeah. monsters. Mm. It's 16. 16. Nice. Okay. Your shot yes. rings through and it does massive damage to it. Good job, babe. Um, you've actually you managed to shoot it straight yeah. through um, its center, so it is actually starting to bleed out. Okay. Nice. Fucking and good then child. I'm just going to move there. 16 and wasn't now even it maxed requires it. a 14 to hit me. Yep. Okay. Now let's Wait, roll us a d6. Three. Real quickly, oh, how much coming. is your max damage for that attack? It has me? rolled. Yeah. It has 20. rolled um, a 3, shit. which means it's coming at you again, Sid. Okay. Okay. Can I count it? Light well, Blast, actually, it fires with a hit of 19, dealing 1 damage to you. This thing has rolled minimum damage so many times, and its second shot misses you completely. Okay, okay. I still have my mech. <laughs> yep. Breathe deep, breathe deep. We're okay, we're fine. <laughs> okay, Ruby, it is now your turn. Take... I'm gonna take a two shot at this a big old bitch. Alrighty. Take it a one two, one shot. Yep. Five and with damage. that, it drops. Oh. And it hits the nice. ground and stops moving. Nice. Combat nice. over? Question mark. Um, there's still a few bugs around, but I'm just gonna assume that if you wanna, you can sort them out. Um, actually, yeah, no, I'm gonna roll to either. see if they oh. fight or flight. Oh, they go to fight mode. Oh no. Okay, so I'm, taunting. I'm gonna uh, let you guys keep your turn orders. And Ruby I'm still just... Ruby did one attack, so can she still do a second one? Yes. Yeah, I was gonna ask. Yep, but you, just can, you can do a second attack. I'm just telling you what happened. Okay. Uh Okay. Go for this one. Uh, hold on. Yeah. Actually, everybody this roll one. me a uh, detect to see if I, I can reveal some more of the map for you. Okay. 19, or 20. 20. Uh, 17. 20 is 20. Well. Twenty, seventeen, twenty. 20, 17, 20. Are those high enough, Lavitz? That is plenty enough to see the entire map. Whoa. There you go. All right, Ruby, you've got one more shot. Oh, yeah. So, are they fighting? Um, yes, they're they're, fighting. they've gone into fight mode. I'm about to say, is this one in range? Yes. Hey, I'm going to shoot this one. Which one? Oh, oh, uh, oh sorry, I didn't mean to move myself. That's all right. Uh, um, this, this one. one. The one, one on the right. Yep, the one on the right, the one that's closest to you. Um, roll yes. us, roll us an attack. Ooh. Okay, that misses. Miss it was a crit fail. That is not one to eat right now. Yeah, that's not something that you want. Right. Okay, can make. I'm gonna take a shot. I'm gonna take a shot at this one. Okay. And then, what's the roll to taunt? Communications. All right, one d twenty. Five. You don't appear that to have um, been able to taunt them. So, oh. so instead of being able to tease them, we kind of just like flopped and just sounded awkward and weird. Yeah, basically you just... yelled in your mech, but you forgot to press the push to talk. No, no. Well, if I'm gonna taunt, I'm gonna do it like a fucking. <laughs> do you take the L for an emo for an emo? We're gonna do it later. We're gonna do it. We'll, okay. We'll nice. So, yep, you fired your pistol once. Oh, wait. Yeah, Torn would be in action. So, uh, 
Yes, so that's two actions. Yep. Okay, Sid, it is your turn. No, oh, okay. Uh, you could probably nail one of the ones way at the back. Yeah. I'll go for that one. Alrighty. Yep. This one just explodes. Can I see that one? Uh, just. I'll give you a minus one to hit it. Okay, I'm just going to go where the one I can actually see that's in 60 feet. Alrighty. Yep. That was this one, wasn't it? Yeah, this one. Yep. Um, with that, you managed to kill it. Okay. Okay, and let me just move these guys. And they're just running straight at you guys. Oh. Kind of scary. Not gonna lie. Oh, holy shit. Okay. Ruby, it is your turn again. Uh, closest one. Closest one. Jesus Christ. That's a miss. Uh, second shot at the closest one. That is a miss as you well. Are you fucking me right now? Are you f uh Kamiko, it is your turn. Yes. Yes. That better luck, man. Okay, Sid, it is your turn. Reminder, oh. these guys have negative two to damage. So... Bruh. So that one's dead. Okay, this one explodes. And three to that one. Which already okay, has two on it. And this one manages to fall to the ground and die. <laughs> I like how the other one just the so much damage is done to it just exploded. Okay. Drone headbutt. And it crit fails and headbutts the carcass. Hitting Oh and hitting one of the claws, it impales its head and dies. Bro, that is so sad. Like, you, I'd imagine within that, like, within the lore, within the world, the, that bug just tried its hardest. Like, it went full, just kamikaze, just impales itself no, no, through the no, eyeball. It Epstein, it, it Epstein itself. What does that mean? It's like, this worker is not our best. In fact, it's not around, allowed around the good furniture. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, Ruby, oh, it is Epstein. your turn. Oh. At first I was like, wait, is there more Ruby subtext to that? No, it's just because uh, Epstein killed himself, okay. Um, no, Epstein didn't kill himself, Ruby, that's the meme. You don't understand. Wait, no, but you said th that he Epstein himself. It, Basically, it, this bug's like, like I've got information I, about I'm, Hillary Clinton. I feel really sorry. Mm -hmm. Yes. Wow. Ah. Very we're very, we're very sorry to find out that uh, the bug has shot itself three times in the back of the head. <laughs> You're such a bitch. Okay, also, which one were you? One. This, one? this one. Yep, that one you managed to kill. You snipe it straight through the face. Mm. And this one's going to its buddy behind it. Oh. Yep, that hits it, but it keeps on coming. Damn. Only one more on attack, and I would have. Well, I've gotten away if it weren't for you meddling kids and your dog. Call me severity, Kamiko. Uh, Jesus, Kamikos. Kaniko, Niko, Ni. Um, your pistol jams. I haven't hit a single shot before. No, but Bruh. you haven't taken any damage. Yeah, you haven't shot taken any. Yeah, yeah, I was about to say. Yeah, sure, you haven't been taking any. Hitting any shots, but you haven't been taking any either. Wait, no, actually, what, meanwhile, I hit the big one for a few damage. Sid is, like, this one. Yeah. Sid is on the verge of death, and I'm not too far behind her. <laughs> Sid, and I'm just here like, yes, time. I am big. <laughs> yes, I am Team Burger. <laughs> I am yeah, helpful. 
Yep, that oh, one's I'm dead. Teamed. You basically oh, pop up straight over the top of the carcass and you're like, peekaboo, pew, and you drop it. <laughs> Combat <laughs> is oh, over. Is That's just pretty I want to go. I think we all know what I'm about to do. Before he goes on his head chopping spree, can I search the big mamma jamma we're on? Yeah, sure. I need the arm for that. Well, Kamiko didn't kill anything, so technically you can't really, shouldn't be able to harvest any of the skulls. I assisted. Ah. Okay, uh, you that find was, nothing well, on I the assisted. corpse. This is... Bruh. Can I, I have a second search? That arm. So, what was that, Ruby? Can I get a second search? Um, after the others have searched it. Oh, okay, yeah. All right. You'll all get um, three searches in this area. Uh, Alright, I, um, I need that arm. <laughs> yep, um, oh. you manage to prise off the arm, and basically within the arm, there's actually two guns. One of them is a sniper weapon that appears to be non functional. And the other one seems to be the equivalency of a light laser, but they're inbuilt into one. Um, one fires from each side. Puppets. You see the big one's head? Fuck. Yep, that head ain't coming off. Piece of shit. And the funny thing is, if it did, you probably wouldn't be really able to carry it. The head is almost as big as your mech. That is acceptable. You know, all right. How about this? You know what? I'm gonna. I'm just gonna take this entire body. Okay. Ah. Um, Roll us a d20 plus hydraulics minus eight. <laughs> Shit. You that fail to even budge it. You can't even lift up one of its arms. Rip. Rip. All right. In that case, do we have some form of? But what? What do you call it? The fucking. Mm. What do you Big, call it? Uh, a lift. Or Earth something moving similar. equipment, oh, like something that, like, like that. A, like a yeah. I don't know. Do you? Uh, I mean, inside the ship. Is there anything or? Not that you're aware of. Great. That sounds like such a I don't know. Can you kind of way of saying it, Lavitz? Okay, Kamiko, you've got one search left. You know what? I'm gonna clear. I'm, I'm gonna clear up these. Uh, I'm gonna clear up these teeth. I want right. to remove some of the teeth. You want to take a tooth? Roll us a d20. Yes. Uh, do I get any bonuses? Um, no. Okay. Six. Fucking you fail great. to get any teeth. Million. You realize that if you put, were to even try to pull one of these teeth, um, it would cause um, completely compression of the entire chamber. Oh. Mm. Okay. Kamiko, right, you've used up all three of your searches. Ruby, you've rolled one search and so has Sid. So you guys each have two searches left. Okay. I'm going to try one case, more. So we'll back at you two. Yeah. And I head back to the ship. I just go join, get back here as soon as you can. Okay. I'm just going to do uh, one more search on the big mamma jamma. Big mamma jamma? Or else, uh, the big mamma jamma. Ooh. Alrighty. What were you particularly searching for? Oh, well, I seem to have been taking a lot of hits. So maybe some sort of like maybe armor, like, not, like some sort of plating I could scavenge off to put onto my own mag or maybe even some sort of like energy you know some either shielding or energy of some okay. sort um yes you managed to find a broken shield generator that is part of its oh. body um it's that green nice. okay. thing right here on it holy fuck yeah oh oh yeah okay 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 and uh, one more search thing. Um, uh, let's see here. Let me really quickly put it down. Broken shield generator. <laughs> Broken alien Broken shield, shield generator. generator. Okay. Remember to specify alien. 
Mm-hmm. Um, and one Alien. more. Sir, um, Sid, your second search. All right, take a look at the little guy there. Alrighty. Um, yes, you managed to f- harvest um, organic repair sacks. Um, you managed to find two of them. Okay. And Ruby, third search. Um, I'll use it to search the guy that I'm on. All right. The slightly smaller big man pajama. Well, this one's more Ooh. taller, but this one is bigger in mass. Chonkier, as they say. Yep. Um, you try and search this thing, but the problem is his armor is so thick that you can't really search it for really anything. It's just like a... Think of it almost like a big chunk of metal, really. So you really can't... Um, I guess some more... Um... Um, could I just try and take some of that? Could that roll be trying to take some of that armoring? Or no, you can't plating? prize any of the armor off. It's a six. Oh, okay. All right. All right. Okay, Sid, your turn. Sid? Mm, let's see what I can find Hello. on this guy. All right. Hello. Anybody, yeah. Yep, your your mech isn't strong enough to actually be able to pull anything or get anything off of it. Hmm, okay. Right, that's it. Alrighty. So you guys going to head back to your ship? I'm already there. Yeah. I, just... I basically went and said, look, alright, once you guys are done, we know where to go. Uh-huh. Don't Joel. be late. Don't be late. As with before, I'll let the captain know that we should probably accelerate our timeline, given that we found the ship very close to starting up. Yep. So you report that to uh, the captain. He yep. says, well, this is quite alarming. Yes. He's like, I'll I'll send the other Federation ships to the remaining ship right now. Well, I'll suggest it anyway. Uh. Alright then. In that case, uh, while you guys are healing up, I guess we'll go back to RCL because I need to... Well, I need to repair my sword and and I can probably do that with well, I probably need to buy a power cell for that. Unless we have... We still have one small power cell on the ship. So I can probably repair my... And then I need to buy a rifle. Huh. All right. And a pistol. Uh, and any healing to mark off um, a full heal crystal or a power cell or an alien bio cell or a pair um, cell? So, I'm going to firstly repair my sword. That's... That's important. Alright, I'm just gonna use my last cell... for now. I'm putting Shadow here, and I'm basically going to say that he's eyeing off the minigun on this, um, mobile hmm. turret. Huh. He's, he's, been doing that for the la- he's been doing that for the last three days. Just staring at it. Not talking or moving or anything. Let people, it's the starting, guards don't pay him any to freak out the security guard. He's starting to freak out, like, the security guard. He's, like, going, he's looking around, like, hello, anyone? <laughs> Your child is lost. <laughs> Your large, large child. Yeah. Anyway, so, um... Every 15 seconds. Can I get that minigun? Can I get that minigun? 
Blavitz. No. So um, I can just put the sword in the fabricator and with the power cell and it'll be fixed, right? Yes. All right, great. In that case, I'm marking off our last small power cell because I don't believe the uh, repair ones I have will do it. And I'm removing that. Well, the repair ones will work for repairing um, equipment to a degree. Oh, well. And your sword is really just chipped, so... Yeah, a standard okay, well, repair cell will it's work. fixed. It's fixed anyway, so we're good. And then I'm off to the market. I'm just shopping. Sorry. No, that's okay. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I just heard that and I was like, I swear to God. And somebody's shopping in this goddamn car. Anyway, I show up to it. Yellow Jack and I go. You got any rifles? He's like, uh, yeah, I've got some um, light blasters that you can purchase. That's all you're qualified to really all buy right. here besides a standard arm, um, sidearm. Uh, I would like a standard sidearm and a light blaster, please. Yep, uh, 3,000 credits. All right, great. I have 91, so now I have 700. And with that, I will remove the rifle needing to be replaced. And I will add in into my inventory. Uh, one spare uh, pistol. Oh, alright. Also, I have a large tooth. Alrighty. Do you want to try and sell that? Or do you want to keep it? Um, I'd like an appraisal. I'd like an appraisal, yeah. Alrighty. Roll us a D20. And it's taking forever. That's nice. Thank you, old twenty. And it's it, nice to meet. Yep. He says, um, "I don't really have much of a use for it, um, but if you manage to find a hunter's lodge somewhere on one of the stations, um, they'll be more than happy to take it off your hands for a pretty hefty price." All right then. I'll say thank you. Pleasure doing business with you. Uh, take the fucking tooth that's the size of me and just walk off. No problem. Alrighty. Sid, what would you like to be doing? Hmm. Good question. Um. I'll see if he has any parts lying around that I could take off him. Uh, D20 plus communications. Oof. He says, I've got a little bit of scrap, but it's really not Actually worth your it. time. Most of it has been packed up right. now. Alright. Um. Could you have any use for... I do have an idea. Bio... Um... Kind of conduits. Uh, he says the science department's already gotten quite a bit of that now, so not really. Our con conduits are better suited for moving our kind of power systems. Um, Elvis says he says that he will give you 170 um, credits for them. I'm good, but I will get some um, full repair crystals off of you. You look very well. Um, 250 credits per crystal. Okay, I'll just give him a thousand and put four crystals in my inventory. No problem. He says, pleasure doing business with you. Thank you. 
And I'm just gonna go back to home, I guess. And Ruby, what would you like to be doing? Um, huh. um well, could I go anywhere to get this alien generator, uh, fuel generator repaired? Um, you can probably talk to Yellowjack about that. Um, D20 plus communications, and then another D20. Okay. D20 plus communication. What are my communications again? Um, I think yeah, your communications is two, isn't it? Communications is actually three. I buffed oh, it. And D20 on my plus last three. Yes, yeah, sir. Um, yeah, he says this tech is completely unknown to me. Um, sadly, you'll probably have to figure out how to either repair it yourself or somehow get um, a scientist who knows how to work this tech. But seeing how most of this tech is unknown to us at the moment, um, he, su he suggests that you just tinker around with it and who knows, maybe you might come up with something. If not, okay. he'd be willing to buy it from you. How much is he willing to sell it? Let's see. Or buy it for, I mean. Um, roll us another D20 plus communications. Okay. Holy fuck. He says he'll give you 50 credits for it. Yeah, no, I'm hanging on to it, thanks, though. He's like, no problem. And, okay. That has eaten up two sections of your day. So you've got basically what you want to do in the afternoon slash evening. Well, actually, on the Sorry, evening. I was looking at memes. Well, stop looking at freaking memes and freaking play the game. I'm so disappointed. <laughs> God. So disappointed. I'm sorry. I know you guys don't want me to interrupt. That's right. All right. Anyway. So, what we would you like to be doing for the evening? Is there a way to turn the two into basically a, uh, how do I put it? Fuck. Um, shit, what did I want to do with the enamel? The enamel. Uh, basically, you know those, uh, yeah, like from the tooth. Or fuck, is it enamel or calcium in teeth? I don't fucking remember. I'm not. I'm not bio. I'm not biology man. I didn't take that. Enamel, I think. Um, it is. Can I can I make like a can I make like a mask out of the enamel or what whatever the, the tooth is made of? Um, so you can like attempt it. But the tooth is quite hard, so you have to roll to basically break down the tooth and then reconstruct it. And it'll take a power crystal with the fabricator, because the fabricator will have to cut and saw and process it. But the big yeah. thing is you've got to actually cut the section off that's small enough to actually go inside the fabricator. In that case, I need to actually uh, probably buy it. What's the roll to cut? Uh, D20 plus tech. That was. D20 All plus tech. Alright, let's tech. try it out. 11. Uh, yeah, you managed to cut a piece small enough to go into the fabricator. Alright, great. And then roll us a D20 I don't flat. have a, a crystal. Oh, wait for Alright, give me a second. I don't need... Yeah, you'll need a power crystal for that. So I want the crystal. Yeah, I don't have one that won't do repairs. So, um, what's the cost of one that does more than just repairs? Alright, um, I'll have Utility crystal is 500. Alright, I'm putting that in. And now, just standard D20. 
whenever it takes long this number. Okay, 12. Yep. It's going to take about a day to do it, but the, it will be able to carve um, a moderately use, usable mask. All right. In that case, I'm going to put... How big of a chunk did I take out of it? Um, you've used the entire tooth. All right. And now, does the mask grant me anything? Or nope. Or does it just look cool? It looks cool. All right, great. It looks cool. That's good. Yeah. Are you watching TV, Sid? Yeah. Yeah, she is. So disappointed. Cause you, yeah, I just like, hey, so can I do this? And you, do it. oh yeah, you can do that and this with the shield. It'll take about a few days. No wonder she probably tuned into a fucking to a tune. Yep. Okay. Well, that's used up this action for you, Kamiko, and your f next two actions for tomorrow. Um, All right, doing this thing. Okay, Sid. What would you like to be doing for tonight? I'm good on money, so I think I can just go and have some fun. Because clearly, clearly, she's not responding, so. Who isn't? And, well, I feel completely, so that doesn't matter anyways. Yep. Okay, you failed to attract a, what was that for, customer, was it? Mm-hmm. Yep, um, actually, let's just see. Actually, you do manage to, um, attract a customer. Oh. Huh. He looks okay. a little shady, though. Wait, that, I'm pretty sure that was for a girl. Mm -hmm. oh, sorry, she looks a little shady, though. Ooh. Ooh. I have way too much to risk. I don't think I'm gonna like can I do an insight or uh yes, you can roll D twenty in um just flat D twenty. Yeah, no. Um she seems on board up on on the up and up. Okay. So it's barely just appearance, but in reality she's Well she looks shady but seems on the up and up with a low roll. <laughs> oh, I see. I'm gonna have to refuse service for tonight. Just say I'm too tired or something. Yep. No problem. Okay, and Ruby, what would you like to be doing for the night? Hmm, try to repair it, I suppose. My um, little shield generator. Oh, the shield generator? No problem. Um, roll us a d20 plus tech. Okay, let's see where my tech goes. I always forget. Um, I think it's two, isn't it? Two. So, a d20 plus, come on. There we go. Plus two. Huh. There it is. Okay, yeah, you managed to figure oh, out God. a little bit of its components. You realize where its power cell would go and whatnot. It is still damaged, but you you understand its functionality to a degree. Mm hmm. So. If you do another roll on it, you'll be able to. You might be able to repair it. Okay, I'll or try that. Or salvage it. Okay, well, it's the next day. Oh. oh, okay. Um, so that's twelve days. Um, there we go. Okay, so 
Um, Kamiko, you only have one thing today, but that'll be later on. Ruby, you've just used your first section of the day, so if you want, you can do your two now. And okay. then we'll go to Sid's um, um, three. I guess I'll use my second half to try and attack somebody. Alrighty. Well, actually, how? Well, that was my role for trying to repair it. How did that go? Um, you failed to learn any more about it. Or repair it. Oof, okay. Alright then, I guess I'll just put that down for now and then spend the rest of my day try maybe making some money. Yep, no problem. Alrighty, where am I? There I am. Alright. Ooh. Okay, okay, a crit. Yep, you basically have your pick of the walk. Um. Yep, you have 11 suitors that you can basically choose from. Holy shit. Um. Would it be possible to do some sort of like group thing in order to get more money in one go? Yeah. With the 25, you can do whatever you want. Yeah, fuck it. I'll be like, alright, who wants to just do a group thing, you know? I'll kind of pool money together, give me a shitload, and then just do whatever for the night. Okay. Um, yes. Um, six of them are willing to do a group thing. Alright, sounds cool. Alrighty. Um, uh, roll us a. Um. My performance or what? Yep, uh, performance. Um. Or whoring plus body. What's my performance? Um, you can either use your communications or your whoring um, plus body. Communications. Um, whoring plus. Um, communications or whoring and whatnot. One or the other. Yeah, yeah. So either a uh, three or a. Uh, my body would be what personal biological biology training. Yeah, that's the plus two. Yeah, the plus two. Oh, so, so then I'll do that. You, you get the body right. and plus either communications or whoring. I thought we well, established both... the maneuverability card. Yeah, communications. Mind. Yeah, you can use maneuverability no, if you'd like. No, it'll be a plus six. Okay. Plus? Um, the... let me just have a double check on your sheet. So, okay. communications is three, um, whoring is three, mm -hmm. uh, no, body is three, which gives you a plus two, um, or whoring, so either way it's a plus five. Okay, so, D so right now I'm just rolling a d20 plus five. Yep. Okay. Oh. Uh, yep, you do really well. Let's see how they yeah. go. Okay, one guy basically blows his load at the start of it. Um, one of the ladies involved um, doesn't do overly well either. She gets worn out pretty quickly. Um, but the rest of them, you take them like a champ. champ. And nice. Okay, and roll us one more d20. Okay. Just normal D20? Uh, just standard D20. Oh, fuck. Okay, um... Oh, no. They don't shut... They don't pay you for the lady and the dude that blows his load. So, in the end, you only get... You managed to make... 600 credits. Oh, on top of my uh, base rate or what? No, 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 your base rate is times three. But, so only oh, three I see. but your whoring is going to go up um, 0.5 of a... No, actually it's going to go up a level. Okay. So, so for, okay, so first off, whoring is going up one level, alright. And then, so then I'm making 600 flat? Yes, yeah, 600 flat. Okay. Nice. And yeah, so your reputation slash whoring skill has gone up. Hmm. Nice. And That's roll bad. me one more d20. Yes, sir. Ah. Yep. 
Never use mind. all my luck in that that twenty and that like that crit. Yeah. Nah, it's alright. Also, if I hadn't stolen um, three crits in a row. Uh. No kidding. I'm surprised that didn't kill you, Sid, because I rolled like minimum damage, like th um, two out of like three out of the five rolls. Yeah. No, I was down to one. Yeah. No, that was really scary. I was really afraid we were gonna lose you that but, fight. But my suit didn't blast open. So, no fun turp for me. Yep. Uh, on the yeah. good thing, um, even if I rolled like 200 damage on you, for example, it'd still bring you down to zero. Uh -huh. Yes, it would have blew, blew open my suit. I'd have one more hit. Yes. Before I'm yeah. So crits don't Just stack like, it's not that. like it's a multi-hit. So, in a way, that's one way to save yourself from being... Quad quad critted <laughs> or triple critted. Yeah. <laughs> um, okay, and Ruby, you've got one more action for the rest of the day. Actually, no, I'm going to assume that used up both actions. Yeah, I was going to say um, I was kind of saying that would be kind of the rest of the day. Yep. But you know, I was basically doing three or how many, however many I could get roped up into that group uh, yeah, um, interaction. Basically, you got um, six of them, but two of them. Um, yeah. One of them got yeah. paid separately. Another one didn't pay, and basically you had like um, it was a group rate. So yeah. So you're not charging individually; you're charging as a group. Okay, Sid. But it still gave me a big cash out. Oh yeah, good cash out, and improved mm -hmm. your reputation. Mhm. Mm if you'd rolled higher on that, um, other things might have happened. Damn. Okay. Crap. Okay, Sid, it is, I think it's your turn to um, do the day stuff. So you've got three three things for the day. Uh, yeah, my first thing, I'm going to tinker around with the alien stuff. No problem. What were you, what are you planning to do before you roll? What do you mean? Like, um, what kind of thing on the alias stuff are you looking into? Like, what is the focus of the look into? The, the stuff I got from the big guy. Okay, yep, the, the two, the two type gun. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm just going to kind of work with it, see what I can figure out from it. Yep, D20 plus tech. Tech or mod or just tech? Just tech. Because basically you'll be observing it and looking it all over, and that's a technical skill. Um, if you're dissembling it or trying to mod it, that would be mod. Okay. Well, it'd be more wanting to reassemble it or fix it would be the biggest thing, but... Um, you managed to figure out exactly how to fix it. Um, and it awesome. is it is a dual rifle. So basically what it does is that you fire either a sniper beam or actually it's more of a plasma blast which is the equivalency of a sniper round or it fires um light blaster equivalency okay um however your mech will have to hold it with both hands mm -hmm. it's that big damn it is massive Whoa. But basically, but it allows you it, to shoot either the equivalency of a javelin blaster or a ja or um, a light blaster, and the light blaster you'll be able to fire twice. Okay. So it's a two-in-one gun. So I. Okay. Now. However, at the moment, the this would be. Oh, sorry. Um. Would this be a possibility where instead of my sidearm, it could be the one javelin shot, then switch to light blaster? Um, no, it requires too much power to do that. It needs like a few seconds to cool okay. down each time it fires. It just allows you to gotcha. fire two, two lesser fires or one big fire. Mm -hmm. 
so it's kind of like a long range or a close up, and I can switch it, it for such a scenario. Exactly. You can either use it. Basically, it allows you to use a sniper rifle or a um, assault rifle, um, and switch between between them without having to swap between guns. Mm-hmm. The sniper is currently slightly damaged, so you'll need to repair that, but you can use your tech or your mod skill to fix it up, and it needs to be powered up. Mm. So you'll need a bio cell. And I've got, well, I've got the mech class bio cell, or I've got the two bio repair cells. Yep, um, if you use a bio repair cell, you can basically just um, squirt that shit on it, and it will literally repair the um, the gun itself. Okay, I'm gonna do that then. <laughs> okay, we'll knock off a repair cell, um, or repair mm-hmm. bio cell, and then all you need to do is insert a bio cell in it, and it'll be fully powered up. Mm. But the bio cell I have is like mech class bio cell, so it's massive. Would that work? Uh, yes, it will work because it is a large gun. But if you want, you could break that mech cell down into, I'm gonna say three, no, four lesser power cells. Three, like four standard power cells. Well, four bio cells. Though. Yeah, standard bio cells. Sure, why not? Alrighty. And you're not even going to have to roll... Oh, wait, you will have to roll to break down the power cells. But the repair Uh, and all that, you won't have to roll for anything of that. Okay, I rolled a four. Um, Yeah, you managed to only get two out of it. Yeah, okay. So I'm down to one... But that means so that also unlocks um, a light blaster for you. Of course, it still has the same range as a light blaster as well, Mm -hmm. Uh which is 60, right? Yes. Cool. Alrighty, so that's your first action for the day. Mm-hmm. Um, what would you like to do for the following two spots of the day? See if I can find somebody again. Okay. Nope. Doubles, yeah. roll again. Um, you walk around, but none of them really, you're like fairly low class still, um, of whoring, because your whoring is level one, Mm. isn't it? Yep. Yep. Um, so, since you're so picky, you don't really manage to attract anybody that's... Oh no, it's two. It's two now. But still. Oh, that's a plus two, so that's... thing. So yeah, you do manage to find one person. Oh, I do? Yes. Oh. Are they on the up and up, though? <laughs> that is a good question. Roll us a d20 t- t- to the deck. Voyager 2 is back yep. online. Um, these ones seem really on the up and up. You have a good oh, feeling about these ones. Alright, I guess I'll take them with me. Okay, uh, d20 plus communications or mo- mo- maneuverability. Or whoring. Okay, so it's a plus two in either of the other two. Oh, come on, that's a nine. Okay. Okay, okay um, you both, uh, actually, both of you are re- end up being quite awkward. 
You know, you're <laughs> off your game. So is she. Um, you can't seem to line each other up correctly. It is overall, it is not a very good experience. Um, so at the end, you're basically kind of like, um, I'll charge you only half because none of us had a good time on that. So you put 50 credits in. Okay. Uh. Oh, by the way, did you say your whole level was two? Yeah. Um, move yourself up to 150. And um, Ruby, um, move yours up to 300. Okay. For a standard rate now that you've leveled up your whoring. You've got a good reputation now. Uh-huh. Well, above average reputation. Uh-huh. <laughs> okay, and for the final section, Sid, what would you like to do for the final evening? I'll see if I can get into the black market and see if they have anything they're willing to trade off. Alrighty. Um... Oh, damn it, I had the um, question for it too. What was that? Ah, oh, damn it. Um, God damn it, now I can't remember what the thing was. Ah, oh, fuck it, just roll me a d20. This time, because I can't remember what I'm doing. Yep, you managed to get in. Okay. <laughs> um, i got to write these fuckers down. Okay, I'm just going to see what their current stock is, like any special stock they have in right now. Yep, anything you're looking in particular, because basically you got to go in there and you got to go, go up to the guy and say, I'm looking for this. Or something like this. Because they don't have an open store, kind of like what this is. They have, um... Yeah. They have kind of yeah, like... I'm looking. You know what? I'm just going to see if they have, like... Biotech. Like what biotech they have in store. Alrighty, roll with the D20 plus communications. Oof. Okay. Um, yeah, they've got a little bit of it. They've got a few spare power cells, some conduits. Um, nothing major. It's more like the runoff that the kind of um the the main science group kind of have pretty much thrown out. Mm. Well. I could still use those bio cells, actually, considering half my weapons are bio weapons at this point. Okay. Um, uh, there's there's the equivalency of six. There's six um, near depleted bio cells. You realize? Um, roll us a D twenty plus mod. Okay. You realize that you could buy all of them up and probably make two um, cells completely out of them. No problem. You could just you can jerry-rig them all together to create a two cells out of the six that they have. How much are you guys asking? Jerry-rig. Yep, they're going to charge you a hundred credits per um, cell. Actually, no, with a 20 like that, 50 credits per cell, actually. Okay, so six cells, so 300. Yep, 300, and you'll get two cell two bio cells out of it. Alright. So that puts me up to three. Well, oh, thanks. Um. Yeah, I think that pretty much will end my day. Don't really have any more business. Okay. Could always try flirting with her again. That never works. <laughs> um, yeah, you remember that she's very straight. Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> we 
Well, yeah, and then the end on the day on, on like a nice tone and half, and like cuddle up with her. Yep. Be nice. Um, uh, H.E. roll us a, um, just a flat D20. Okay. Okay, oh, both thanks. of you, um, come together, cuddle up, and you have a lovely, calm, quiet, lovely night. Yay. You're falling asleep <laughs> in each other's arms. <laughs> That's very cute. And with that, I'm gonna go, I wanna go <laughs> die. Wait, what? Nothing. You know what you say? Come on. I just said, can we go get in here? <laughs> what the heck, you weirdo? What? What are you gonna do? Is it going to join our cuddle party? No. You're such a bully. It was a joke. Like, no, I like the penis. I'm dreaming of Picard right now. Right. Yeah, oh, really yikers. Also, you're aliens. Yes, but you still actually care for us. That's Somewhat. True. Not in that way, Sindrin. It will never be in that way. <laughs> I know. <laughs> if you fucking try elves, I swear to God. Miku, you wish somebody would want to feel it upon you. <laughs> just you wait. You say just you, well, just you wait for what? Why shift to the cantina? Do, I, I, I'm pretty sure, didn't I go to the restaurant when you were there? And you were just getting no, fucking... No, no, Sidrin went to the restaurant. And she tried to start a fight. And then yeah. later we killed the guy. Yeah. Okay, um, whose room were you in? Was it in Sid's or Ruby's room? Um, let's say Sid's. Alrighty. Let's say, like, um, maybe Sid turned in early because, you know, she didn't have that much of a day until I came in a little bit later and I was like, hey, you know, kind of exhausted from my escapades and being like, hey, uh, I, um, maybe I heard that, like, she had, like, a bad day thing, like, not that best of a day, especially when it came to, like, doing her job. Yep. So, I came to come. <laughs> yep. Your and suits cleaners are working on overtime. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oof. Okay. And a car's room is... Is that, is that the end of everyone else's day? I think uh, so, yeah. Yep, that's the end of the day. Your suits are fully repaired. Hold on. Um, I did not get my action. You didn't? I two, thought... of, uh, two of three were taken up by the mask. The third one hasn't been done. Uh, that's right, yep. Oh, uh, yeah. That's right, I forgot about that. Yes. So, I want to go to the canteen and work. Alrighty, no problem. Uh, um, that's just a d20. Uh, yes, standard D20 plus communications. 16. Okay, yep, um, you do a standard day. What was your standard pay? 75, wasn't it? Uh, something like that, yeah. Yep, 75 plus $10 um, tip, so you make $85 credits. Alright, great. Now, How much did she get sexually harassed? That is a good question. Well, it's, well it's, now, hold on, before you do, um, also... We just went through combat. Did we get any experience? Uh, yes, you did. You all got three right, experience great. points. Okay, good. I'm making sure. Okay, so that means that I am now... Uh, that's the wrong side. Stop. Alright, so that's... Uh, nine out of seventeen. Okay. No problem. And once again, your ass feels like a pin cushion where um, a lot of... Um, Surly sailors were making off-the-cuff comments and pinching your butt quite regularly. I'm considering wearing the mask. It's up to you. Yeah, I, I might do that. Alright, no problem. You now have a dishonored style mask. Like one of those uh, death masks, you know? Yeah, it looks like the like mask that. from Dishonored. Uh, if I can hold on, let me search it up. Okay. 
but it's white. Okay. Alrighty, a new day starts. Sid and Ruby, Hi. you wake up together, you're feeling very well rested. Well, wait, before it says a new day, do you want to maybe end, end the game? Yep, up to you. <laughs> yeah, how will we end it there and then next time we can pick up on a new day? No problem. Mm -hmm. Alrighty, and so I'll just re-place um, this. And there we go. So that's a good little reminder for me. So there's 11 days into RCL jumps. Um, getting stuff from the shop now is going to be quite difficult because most shops are pretty much all packed up. All right. Because each shop needs to pack up and everything needs to be fully secured and locked down. So we'll just salvage or take down the other live-ish ships and then actually we should finish repairs what else needs to be done um basically the only thing that really needs to be done is your hull um i haven't been charging you fuel for um for just going back and forth because i'm just basically taking that out of the salvage cost that you're getting well, we could also get aids up to full power, too. Yep. yep. Well, his, it's not so uh, much that his power is that he's actually still physically damaged. Well, we could get him to full. Um, AI is 10,000 to get him to full. Hull is 8,000 to full. Okay, next couple of days we are going to be busy. Yep. Now remember, when RCL jumps, um, your ship will be left behind. Mm hmm. So just want to make sure that's fixed. Okay. Jammed power online. Yep. Remember, if you ever want to see anything that's going on with a ship, I. Um, always do that with the ship status here. Are we done here? Um, yep. We are done. You've marked down your XP. Um, yep. yep. 